Hello? Hello, hello? Hello! <laughs> We're back! Welcome back! It's Tuesday. It's a new week. Well, stream week. And, uh... That means that we're gonna be playing in Stars in Time. And it hasn't been... Well, it's been a, a little while since last time. Uh, and that is... Well, because I haven't streamed on Tuesday. Which is, like, the in Stars in Time day that I'm gonna stream the game. I just haven't been live on Tuesday as I'm supposed to. I don't know. Mondays and Tuesdays have not been it lately. <laughs> we have a lot of mig migraines at the beginning of the week for some reason. But Robin is today's first, Palm is today's second, and Donald is today's third. Welcome in guys, I hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a good day. Happy Tuesday! Indeed, indeed. Happy Tuesday to you too, Robin. Hope you're doing good. Hope you've been... Hope you guys have had a good weekend as well. What did I do this weekend? Um, like, now that I think about it, I feel like I just slept all... all the time. <laughs> Tuesday! Hey, Chris! How you doing? How you doing, Krauses? Krauses? Hold on, let me give you shouty outy. Uh, 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 I was looking at the wrong monitor. Like, why isn't the text appearing? <laughs> but it, it was, it was. Go follow Chris if you haven't already. It's true, he is everyone's internet dad. <laughs> How am I doing? Giga vep, 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 fripia? Uh, I'm, I'm doing, I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. Um. So, again, I actually had a migraine today as well, <laughs> but I took meds and I felt fine, but I still needed to go to the grocery store. I needed to, I needed to buy some stuff. Um, it couldn't wait. And honestly, that has been the, the most difficult thing that I've had to do, like physically difficult thing that I've had to do in, in a long time. Because I decided to go to the grocery store that is, like, farthest away out of the two that I usually go to. And it was... How how far is it? I think it's like three kilometers. So it, it's like, it's not long. It's not a long walk. But today it was. Because I was still on, like, I was on meds and everything. And walking in the heat... It's like, I have never felt, I don't know, it, it was just, it was just so difficult for some reason, and it never is. Like, it's just walking, and I never have issues with that, but this is the reason why I can't do things while I'm on my meds. <laughs> like, I've been told, like, ah, you can, you can, you can do, like, all the things that everyone else do, as long as you use meds, you know, you can go to work, and you can do all the... I don't think people realize how... No. No. It's like, your brain feels like it's made out of cotton, and your body feels like it's three times heavier than it usually is. And it's just it, it doesn't work. it doesn't work. <laughs> so when I when I got home, I tried to take an I didn't work though. But yeah, so I'm I'm as we would say in Norwegian. I actually don't think that you guys say this in English, but it's so funny that <laughs> what 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 I would say is I feel slightly reduced today is is what I would say, but. I don't know, do anyone actually say that in English? It, I don't think so, but I, it, I I like how we say it in Norwegian though. <laughs> because it's like, it's not the same as being tired. It's just, you, you kind of just depleted in a way, but re reduced. Yeah, you just like, you, you, <laughs> I don't know, I just, you like that? You're having it? Mm. 
<laughs> but yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready for in in stars and time. Um, right now I'm playing too many games at the same time on stream. Me being the type of person who prefers to only play one game at a time. Um. Yeah, so Tuesday is usually my In Stars and Time day that I stream this game. And and besides that, I, I've only been playing Elden Ring now. But we also started a game called Weko, uh, the Mass Gatherer, on Saturday. So it's it's a short game. It's a fairly short game, so it's gonna take like maybe two or three streams. So I think we're gonna do that tomorrow. And then we're gonna play Elden Ring on Friday and Saturday. I think, I think. But for those of you who don't know, we're doing a weapon wheel spin run um, of Elden Ring, where I'm gonna spin a wheel, uh, where I'm gonna use a randomized weapon when people, like for every fifth sub or 1500 bits, um, and so far, I've been, ha been having a lot of fun with that. Try to... I don't remember how many weapons it is. is it, has it been eight? Seven? Eight? Nine? I don't know. Something like that. It's been a lot of fun. And um, as an extra incentive, I'm also going to do my, my Ronnie cosplay once we hit this goal as well. This is outside of that goal, though. But... Nine? Okay. <laughs> hey, Orion! <laughs> Orion! How you doing? I hope you're doing well. Um, reduced? Not really. Diminished is a bit of a term used for slightly hopeless, non-energetic mood. Mm. Yeah, reduced is like something we would say when... Um, you could say when you're hungover, for example. It's like you're not sick, but you're like... not in in the best form i guess i were like in the best yeah you're sl you you a reduced version of yourself <laughs> basically <laughs> i don't know <laughs> um make sure everyone subs slows not allowing them to re resort to the emotional support weapon that I will resource it, that's <laughs> But it, yeah, my, my weapon that I use when when the, the wheel spin thing isn't going is, is just a dual wielding katana thing. Uchi katana. Because that is my comfort weapon. <laughs> what words? Like in Norwegian? Well, I'm, I'm basically just translating it directly. Uh, because in Norwegian we say reducert, uh, which is the exact same word as reduced. <laughs> um, but you're doing okay, not like at full capacity, but better than Saturday. Mm. Well, that is good to hear, though, that you're doing better. That's good to, that you're doing better. Um, yeah, I had to, I had to force myself to go out to buy some some cat food and everything. And, uh... Now I don't have to go shopping for probably a whole week. So that's good. <laughs> uh, I gotta say, yes, that is the word. That is the word. It's, it's kind of funny how you can, based off of context, you can just... Even if even if it's a different language, it's nice when when some words are pretty similar. You know, you know. Also, did you hear that? Sometimes when I when I speak, you can hear some. Sometimes I'm not sure if they're like swallows or if they're bats, but I think they're swallows right now. Um. <laughs> Buddy. Uh, when was the last time I played this game now? Let's see. It was on July 10th. So it's been 20 days. No, July 9th, actually. 
Damn. That's too long. That is that is too long. Bet, bet, bets? Bets, yeah, bats, bats. <laughs> you were in the shop uh, stores today and you were hesitant to go going if you got overwhelmed or something, but it was okay ish. Mm. Yeah. I hate that when, when you have to go shopping and you just know that your nerves are not at the right place for it. <laughs> Stop slapping you. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, also, what we need to do in the game today is because... So the thing about this game is that you kind of have to die and start over. You kind of in a loop in a way. And you're in a party of while well, you're with four other people. But you are the only one who remembers uh what happens before you die and everything. Um so you kind of have to die to start the day over. Um but yeah, your other party members don't remember anything. It's only you. And last time we stopped right after respawning, I guess. <laughs> and we need to go to a house where a dude... Uh, I actually don't remember what we were looking for, but it, it was something. So we need to go to a house and find something. <laughs> Didn't want to come back home when you weren't there yet when in the car but luckily it wasn't too bad even though it wasn't the best mm. yeah that is that is a known feeling i do i do know that feeling maybe we should just go into the game also this game has such nice music and it's one of those rare games where you just feel like the characters are very real you know they just feel like they're actual people which is so nice when it comes to any games, really. I feel like it doesn't happen often enough. Um, wasn't there a person you meant to ask something? Maybe, but I, I know that there was an, a guy with a shop or something. When we needed to get... Not a... I don't know if it was a... It wasn't a key. Maybe it was a key. Yeah, as you can see, it's been it's been a little while. It's been a few weeks, so my my memory is a little bit foggy. But you know, we will we will figure it out. We will figure it out. They're very cool. I agree, and I also I just do relate so much to the, the the character we play as. Um, I don't I don't know. It it just. I, I just I just like all the all the characters I really do but yeah let us jump into the game and all the puns yeah all the puns too I love uh, we, we love good puns in this in this 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 stream this place yeah let us let us jump into the game I have not changed the game category well I mean I haven't changed the the game capture I mean Uh, uh, game capture. There we go. It's it's like with the with the Undertale where you have to press F four. It also has really nice music. Four frogs. I never really thought of that until, um, yeah, yeah, I know, I know, but I, I didn't really think of that until, um, until you pointed it out when I did my, my second playthrough of Undertale. Load 
Did you find the small frog in the wall? I don't... Don't remember. Love this music. It's so good. It's so simple, but it's so catchy. <laughs> Hold on. Also, one thing that I wasn't aware of when I started this game is like I didn't know that you were you were um, you could like romance people in this game either. <laughs> I mean, it's it's a very small thing. It's not like a, a central thing at all. But it's basically you, you, it seems like you could choose between two people. And I, I didn't know that at all when I started playing. I... This is us! You forget that emote happens. <laughs> pew. <laughs> pew pew. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention it's black and white. <laughs> Sifrin, yeah. S Sifrin is 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 the the character we're play playing as. Sifrin, you're up. Usual, please. <laughs> uh, so yeah, you can. It, from what I understand, I actually don't know for sure, but it seemed like you could choose between her and the person we chose, which is Isabo. It's 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 our bow is a bow. <laughs> hey, Sifrin. Eh. So, how was your nap? On a scale of one to ten. Okay. Um. It was Mirabelle. Hmm. It was all right. I'm glad. I know how much you value your naps. Oh wait, I had something I wanted to ask you. Um, I have an idea for tonight. This will be the night before we go to fight the king, so I felt like we could make it special somehow. So I was thinking, how about a sleepover? Let's all eat good food together. Sleep in the same room. Maybe tell stories. It would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, you know what to say. Make her happy. That sounds like an amazing idea, Mira. Yeah, so we've done this before. We have done this before. Uh, that's why it shows up like a, a fast forward button so you can skip it, but seeing as it's been so long, I'm just going through it again. <laughs> uh, that sounds like an amazing idea, Mira. Yeah? Oh, I'm so glad you think so. I was thinking it was a little silly, but if you think it could be fun, then great. I can't wait. This will be delightful. I'm smiling just thinking about it. You're happy she's happy. You smile back. So, could you let, let everyone know? I would really appreciate it. Uh, sure. Okay. Let me think. Madame Odile should be in the shop buying items. Bonnie should be near the fields to the east. And Isabeau is at the favorite tree to the west. We're staying in the clock tower at the east of the town. Right past, um, the broken bridge. So you can just tell everyone to meet up there later. That was a lot of names and places. Will you remember? You think so, yes. I always remember things. <laughs> well, unrelated to your memory, here's a note with everyone's location, just in case. You forget. <laughs> you got the reminder note. You put the note in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Okay, see you at the clock tower later then. I'll be near the library if you need me. You can talk to me whenever. Oh, and I forget to check the changed god statue too. Good luck. You wave goodbye. Yeah, so we can choose, uh, this is like the, um, the save point, so we can choose a stat that we will get a boost in, which will count for each, uh, death, I guess, uh, or... Or, like, until we respawn again, I think. Hey, Tusta. It was only a matter of time until she would also show up. Uh. 
The change god's blessing has been reset now that you're back in Dormont, so time to get a new one. You believe strongly, or whatever, that your hits will be- it will super hurt, that attacks against you will be super weak, that you'll be super fast. Okay, so we chose super fast last time. Uh, before then, I just chose uh, defense, which is probably what I'm going to choose again. Best offense is a good defense, exactly. Exactly. You win if you and your friends are the only ones standing. You repeat under your breath, super strong, super strong, super strong. <laughs> Pale butt for G. Uh, you actually really, you actually feel a little stronger. You pinch yourself. Ouch. Okay, then, not that much more powerful. You and your allies' defense got boosted a little. Close your eyes. Yeah, we don't we don't have to save. Um Wow. Okay, that's enough for this loop. You thank the change god for its blessing and quickly run away. Yeah, so we need to find the house. We're not gonna go through everything. Okay, this is not the place. Um I think it was a shop with a an old man. You know, the end of the world is fine and all, but I only have one regret. I I won't be able to know what happens to Lord J Joseph Andre in the final issue of the Cursing Chateau Castle. <laughs> Did he manage to protect his castle to the very end? Did he finally find his friend Pierre Jacques Ernest? Did he finally find uh, um finally more find more about himself? Oh. I'll never know. You didn't really care about their problem before, but... The Cursing of Chateau Castle, is it? Interesting. Maybe you could find the last issue for them. Maybe we could. Hmm. Hello. Welcome to my home, complete stranger. Oh, you're, uh... You're one of the people traveling with that Mirabelle, aren't you? One of the saviors. Yes, I like going to in into stranger zones. <laughs> Don't we all? Since you're here, can you help me? I'm trying to figure out which necklace to give my lovely, wonderful, beautiful wife. She stops what she's crafting and shows you two necklaces. One with round beads and one with teardrop-shaped one. Fix to her, her wife is not moving an inch. Yeah, I'm gonna pick the teardrop because I like that shape better. You're right. I think she'd be happy about this one. She gently attacked Attacks, by the way. Attaches the necklace around her wife's neck. And look at her for a while. Pain. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Pain. <laughs> uh, yeah, that clip. Um. <laughs> Pain can also be fun sometimes. Hey, make sure to defeat the king tomorrow, okay? I like... I'd like to ask my wife which one she actually prefers. Yeah. You'll definitely be able to save everyone with this power you have. So she'll definitely be able to ask her which necklace she actually prefers. Was it here? No. Welcome to the library. Well, our selection is kind of lacking. All the good books are in the house. The house is, well, close until further notice, since the king took residence there and froze everyone in time. Are you looking for a book in particular? Are you? Nope. No problem. Let me know if you can help me with anything. Okay, so it's not here, it's probably past here. Library? L l l yeah. The door seems to be locked. It's locked by one of those weird locks. You need to know what uh, know the open phrase to be able to open it. Say change. You say the word change aloud. The door unlocks. Well, all right then. Oh, yeah, we have not been here before, but because we didn't have the the word. A letter is laying on the barrel. There seems to be something inside. You open it. 
You can only describe the item inside the letter as a long thingy thing. A long thingy thing. You got the long thingy thing. <laughs> you put the thingy thing in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Maybe it will be useful la later. Let us see what the, the, the thingy thing is. Uh... Long thingy thing. It's a long thingy thing. Doesn't get more descriptive than that. Are you sure? Are you sure? Hey, look at the thingy thing. What could this be for? Oh, damn. I want to know what it's for. <laughs> That's a barrel. That's a barrel. That too. And that. Spices and other ingredients. Hmm. Some old architecture plans. Okay, so that was only the only thing that is here. So the thingy thing must be very important. You keep thinking Undertale right now. Everything is always reference to something. Mm. Bonnie's here looking morosely at the fields. Bonnie. Hey, friend. <laughs> oh boy. What do you want? Questions. Uh, clock tower, sleepover. Sleepover? That's pretty dumb. Was it your idea? Hey. Mira's actually. Oh! Then it's a great idea. Why didn't you come up with it? Stars, you do not know how to deal with Bonnie anymore. <laughs> yeah, th this character is probably the one that I like the least. I have to say. <laughs> Questions. Uh, anything weird happen lately? Weird? Just a second ago, I saw, like, the biggest bee. Okay. How big, though? Like, like, this big. Bonnie makes a fist and points to it to show that, yeah, that's how big it was. <laughs> wow. That's very big. Are you making a pun? Bee? Big? <laughs> that's a reach. <laughs> that's a that's a reach. Oh, that's pretty good actually. Why didn't you come up with it? <laughs> and Bonnie sees your crestfallen face and snickers. <laughs> Questions? Uh, nothing. Hmm. See you at the clock tower. Yeah, we don't have to go through all of that again. What is this a barrel? It's full of carrots. Carrots. Oh, is someone there? Hi, I um, I'm kind of technically half blind too. Half blind? Oh, you're that savior. Oh yeah, we have an eye patch. <laughs> the one with an eye patch, aren't you? I've heard about you. Ah, I see. I'm trying to get advice from another blind person, I see. I've heard from people in the village that this is a new development for you. Yeah, it happened a little while ago. I see. And how are you dealing with it? You decided a while ago that you wouldn't worry about it, so... Well, it's fine. Okay. Well, if you need advice from another blind person, you know where to find me. Ah, oh, you're fine. <laughs> okay. Hey. Hey, big-hatted one. My mother talked about you. She said you're a traveler with a big hat, but it doesn't mean you're a wizard. Because wizards aren't real. Are you a wizard? You wish. Boop their nose? <laughs> I'm just gonna boop their nose. Uh-huh. <laughs> Did you do something? <laughs> frog spell. I'm gonna say frog spell. Did you make me a frog? Hey! Not cool. Frogs are... <gasps> oh. Frogs are so cute. They are? Thank you, kind wizard. For making me a frog. <laughs> oh, yes. It's tr true. This person really likes frogs. It's because kids really are the worst. Mm. The little girl making a frog embroidery seems too shy to make eye contact with you. Hi. Hi. 
She seems shy. You like frogs? Yes. Me too. They're totally awesome. Oh, <laughs> totally. Like toads. <laughs> Success. Yeah. The kid still dances as she looks at you curiously. You look so weird. Are you from up in the sky? Are you? No. It's okay. I won't tell anyone. The kid nods seriously at you. Yeah, I just... I wanted to choose the one that I hadn't chosen before. <gasps> Look at the sheep! Meh. Meh. <laughs> was it... I think... Was it this one? <gasps> yeah, we needed a... Didn't we need a flower? That was what we needed. I knew there was... Hello. Uh, are... Aren't you one of the saviors traveling with Mirabelle? You're doing so much for us. I wish I could help you in some way. I know. I grow flowers. No, wait. It wasn't flowers, was it? Beautiful flowers that could make someone you like happy. Here, have one. You could keep it or gift it to someone special. You got the bright flower. You put the flower in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Yeah, it was not a flower. <laughs> But I did forget to give the flower, though. Mm. The sign says, My friend made a sign for my house, so now I have to keep it. <laughs> Some recipes. Shells filled with various foods. Being near them makes your stomach grumble. Beautiful cutlery. Oh, there's a broken griddle pan in there. You didn't notice it before. Ah, oh, this? I've been meaning to throw it out. Do you want it? Bonnie might like one of those, even if it's broken. You nod. Got a griddle pan. You put the griddle pan in your pocket. pockets for Bonnie to equip later. Oh, hello, traveler. I hope the smell in here isn't too overpowering. I'm cooking a lot of different things for tomorrow. All of us in Dormont talked a few days back, and we decided that while you'll be exploring the house to fight the king, everyone in the village will be partying. That way, if you win, we'll already have the party in full swing. But if you don't, and we all get frozen by the king's curse, we'll be frozen in time, but at least we'll be happy. Still a weird thing to do, you think? A party. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I've, I've said this one before, you know, because it's grayed out. Well, you're gonna say the other one. That's weird. Huh. Well. Yes, it is. Vogard is so weird. Actually, you know, I don't think that that is that weird. Well, I mean, the whole situation is weird. But considering the situation they're in... Maybe it wouldn't be so weird. Uh, let's see. Some crafted paintings of various meals. Okay. So it's not here. We need to go back. You think it's reasonable logic? Mm. Hoi, traveling one. Oh, you're with Mirabelle and the lady with the glasses. I recognize you. Can you believe Mirabelle has been blessed by the change god to save us all? The change god almost never gives blessings of any kind. It's truly amazing Mirabelle has been chosen. May the change god protect her in her journey. You nod again. Blessings by the change god, huh? You wonder if the change god is the one who revived you and gave you those powers. Eh, it doesn't matter that much. Oh, before you forget. Know anything about locked doors in the house? Locked doors? Ah, yes. There's one lock locked by one of those word locks. Let's see. Ah, I remember. The open phrase to open it is... Sto storage room. Sto storage room. Okay. S st st <laughs> okay, so this is what we were looking for, I guess. Because there's a storage room inside. But I didn't want it to unlock you who just said storage room. Makes sense. 
don't look at me like that. Well, either way, there's not much in there. Nonetheless, I hope it helps you on your journey tomorrow. Closet filled with everything from empty salt shakers to half broken pencils. Are they for sale? How would you read that in Norwegian? Uh, I'm not sure. La <laughs> lago Probably. <laughs> some papers. There's some sort of sale happening, it seems. Odile is here, looking at what the shop has to offer. Odil. Oh, Sifrin. You look rested. Glad to see you this laid back on the day before the end of the world. Anyway, how can I help you? Um, Clock tower sleepover. A sleepover? Ugh. You guys really are kids. We can forget about our problems. I suppose so. Nonetheless, I'll be there. Or Boniface probably needs it. Maybe we all do. But the room only has three beds, right? I better get a whole bed to myself. Mira and Bonnie will probably be sharing. Mirabel and Bonnie? So who will sleep on the ground? You or Isabel? I think me and Isa will share. I mean, th this is this is what we decided. This is what we decided. We have said both now, so, you know. Fascinating. Anyway, I'll be there. You know, since we already decided earlier we'd meet at the clock tower and all. You really don't have to talk to everyone again. Anything else? You suppose you don't need to tell her every time. Okay, I actually thought that I needed to tell them to go to the clock tower. <laughs> uh, the, the game kind of had to remind me that I don't have to talk to everyone again. Uh, hello, young lad. Sit down next to me. You can sit on the benches and stools by walking into them. Yes, I know. Just walk into them. Very intuitive. Thank you for teaching me. Oh, you're so sweet. It's no problem at all, sweetie. <laughs> One of the reasons why I also want to talk to some of them again is because... We don't have to go all the way back here when we die. So I just want to make sure that we don't miss out on anything that could have happened again. Like the door that we could unlock, for example. Horrifying, isn't it? Our beautiful house of change warped in such, so into such a terrible shape. The king awaits inside, waits for the entire country to finally be frozen in time. I shall pray for your victory, your victory tomorrow. But he mentioned the, the, the store room. Banana peel is here menacingly. <laughs> but wait, instead of a banana peel, could it be a plain, plantain peel? Whatever. Plantains are just bananas that taste bad. This is a banana peel to you, now and forevermore. Step closer. Will we slip on the banana peel if we get closer? <laughs> You decide to step closer. Here we go. Uh oh. I guess I died. <laughs> you slipped on a banana peel. Uh, I, I actually did not think that that would happen. <laughs> uh, I mean, do we technically need to start over where we just... <laughs> Did we actually have to do that? Like, because we, we just got the door, you know? So we can just go back here. Just die like that? Yeah, that, that's kind of a weird way to die. <laughs> uh, use 10 to loop forward to floor 2. Hold on. Use 5 to loop forward to floor 1. Sure. It's like your back broke, yeah. Truly a dangerous forbidden fruit. 
But since death seems to be the easiest way to loop, this banana peel might come in useful sometime. True. Uh, okay, that's how we skip. Yeah, we don't have to go through that dialogue again. Because this is just picking up loot that we've uh, picked up before. Uh, now you didn't have the sleepover, I know. I know. We'll, we'll, we'll do it again at some point, I'm pretty sure. I'm just in this room to pick up loot. Pretty much. Because they don't have anything new to say here anyway. Or anything that we haven't seen before. God damn it! I'm trying to go through the door. <laughs> but yeah, at least now we know. I mean, I should have known when it asks you, do you want to step on it? Because... Yeah, it just it just makes sense. You look around the pillar. Oh wait, yeah, yeah, I we we know. This is the first time we died. Let's go, everyone. Not even faced, huh? Yeah. This this was the way we died the first time. Was it the second time? No, I think it was the first. Well, this one I expected would be locked. Oh yeah, we, we haven't... We need to pick up the key again. Yeah, let's just get this over with. I didn't think it was obvious that you would, like, die. I thought you would just slip and... Yeah, I mean, I thought... I thought so too. <laughs> He does rock damage, so we're gonna do that. Smash. Oh, that was pretty good. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah, I, I didn't think I would die from that either. Knife to meet you. You say one cool one-liner. <laughs> uh, this, this, I love this game. <laughs> it's so funny. So, do we have any- no. Send it to her so she can use paper. Damn. Super sparkle heal. I mean, she should heal herself, honestly. But she also should use the attack. go 
Some vials, we picked them up. We got salty broths. Um, a figurine of the change god. It's been destroyed. Some books. One of them has a very striking cover of a Mwudu clay figurine with large sunken eyes and a screaming mouth. Spooky. Spooky. Uh, I don't think anything was in these um, cabinets. The door is locked tight. It's locked by one of those weird word locks. Say st 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 Well, we have used change to open this one before. So, I know that that works. Oh, worth a try. Oh, yeah. Shit. Okay, we have to use the other one, then. S -s -s storage room. The door unlocked. What? Well, let's go inside, then. A hole in the wall. The hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. How would you know? It's a... Um, Potterian Volgardian translation dictionary. It's open to a page of Volgardian uh, words starting with a T. Taciturn? What does taciturn mean? It's someone who doesn't speak up very often, Boniface. Oh, like Frin, okay. Yes, just like Sifrin. Hey! I speak up sometimes. Um, not really, Sif. My teacher always says we gotta speak up more. You're an adult, so why don't you speak up more, stupid? See? This is- See? This kid called me stupid. This, that's why I like them the, the least. Why don't you? You just don't have much to say. It's simpler to just let people talk. I just don't have much to say. Hmm. And it's nice to hear you all talk. Oh. Aw. That's cute. That's a lovely thing to say, Sifrin. Huh? <laughs> it feels like we tamed a wild animal, doesn't it? Perfect analogy. <laughs> Maybe soon we'll even be able to pet them. Oh, crab, stop. Just imagining it makes me emotional. Are they making fun of you? You hide your face under your hat. See, now I'm back to shy, skittish animal. All this hard work. Wasted. Face warm, you walk away. <laughs> Yes, yes, we're coming. Some vials, let's see. You got two salty broths, you give them to Bonnie for safekeeping. Ginger juice, sweet tonic. So being called a wild animal is okay then? Mm. Well, I kind of relate to that in a way. <laughs> The bookcase is filled with many books written in many different languages. Bogardian, Poterian, Mwudu. One of them is written in a language you cannot read. Just looking at it is giving you a headache. I feel like this room looks different now. Or did we? No, we were never able to get in here, did were we? Stool. Because I do not shake. Okay. I don't remember any any of this. We need the extra XP. God damn it, stop attacking her. Um Turn it up. Send it to Odile. Paper. Damn. Damn. A pillar. I 
I'm definitely not looking around me and I'm admiring the view instead of so tell me if I'm about to run into something dangerous. Whoa, 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 whoa. You keep Isabel from running into the life-ending tears. Huh? Huh? What? What? What is it? Is it the water? Should I not touch the weird floating water? Same weird water as before. Oh wait, I've heard about those. The villagers in Dormont call them tears and if you touch them you get frozen in time. Wait, so I almost died? Maybe you should pay more attention, distracted one. I'm keeping my eyes open for all the threats except the one in front of me. We should be more careful. We won't want to touch those. Also, also, I also heard that being frozen makes you go to sleep and gives you a super good dream. Oh? Oh? Oh. Did you hear this from the people in Dormont too? Um, um, mm, a nice lady told me that when she heard my sister got frozen. Oh. 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 I know it's not true. I'm not stupid. Just, it would be nice if that was true. So, so you should touch the weird frozen water and be frozen and let me know how it goes. Pass. Well, we might still need to go this way, so we should look around and find if there's a way to make those disappear. Uh, is he secretly Batman? <laughs> Wait, was that the quote you were looking for? A sadness? But you have to be a B or B. Do it. Do it. Oh, poor buddy lost its friends. Oh, this one feels weird. Funny face. It may look different, but it's still a sadness like all the ones we've seen before. Still feels weird. I believe the preteen when it comes to the sadness weirdness, madame. Let's get the weird sadness then. Can you stop attacking her? Everyone attacks her for some stupid reason. Um, I don't know what it's weak against now, though. Didn't sh Hmm. Does it say? It doesn't say. About the quote? You're just looking at random quote. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. That's okay. That's okay. I actually don't know what it. Sure. Let's just try paper. Okay, that was not it. But you should heal yourself. Okay, let's try that. <gasps> Bonnie yells encouragement, everyone. Wait, what? Ah, so it's. It's scissor. It does scissor attack. But then he can't do anything either, so we're just gonna skip that turn. I guess we could just try to go for a, a jackpot attack. Hmm. 
then that means that I have to do... Oh, God damn it, I can't use rock then. Uh, let's try paper, because I actually don't know. I wonder if I can use it now. I can. Okay, I'm gonna I'm just gonna guard. Wait, it's you again? Or me again? Oh shit. Okay, we're not getting the jackpot attack. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> okay, so he was weak against scissor attack then? That's weird because... Oh well. Got the star crest. You put the star crest in your pocket. A crest feels weird too. Like the tears we just saw. Yeah, that's that's why we ha we picked it up. A hole in the wall. The hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. Also, we're having an ad, so I'm not doing anything. Didn't know Ronnie made jam. <laughs> oh, she does. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Can any things you're pretty sure make your stomach upset nowadays? Like sometime now? Like anything? Or everything? Or is it something specific? Like some specific ingredients? Because that's... That sounds a bit strange if it's everything. <laughs> we got into the game so early today that I was like, wait, this is the first ad break. <laughs> You're not really sure, but all candy stuff you have eaten, unless it's one... Like one piece or something. Hmm. Not counting chocolate stuff because they definitely have lactose. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Wait, I picked up something. For Bonnie. Uh... Hmm. So it's just slightly better, but it is better. Hmm. Good to know. Good to know. Uh, someone says it might be because sugar and because you have had big uh, time and didn't really eat candies at all, really. Hmm. You also get when you have tried to drink juice, orange, and or apple juice that someone gets upset as well. And it didn't used to be like that. 
Damn, so sugar in general will, will do that? The tear floats gently. You have a star crest, so use the star crest. Yee. Yeah. It worked. Bye bye, tears. Ow. You hit your hip into the counter again. Oh. And Sifrin. Did you really hit the counter and say, Nya? You did. Yes. Sif. 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 Cat Sif. Cat Sif. <laughs> A fly for the Dormont Boulangerie. Bread 20% off every Saturday. Because we loaf you almost as much as you loaf our bread. Mmm. Ugh. Bad. Hey, Sif. You look at Isabeau. Considering how much bread we bought from them from, for dinner yesterday. Let's go. Loving us is the yeast they could do. No. <laughs> why? Why do people hate puns? It's just, it's the best. See, this is why this is why I chose Isabeau. Because we are on the same wavelength here, okay? You know? <laughs> yes. Teamwork. Teamwork. You made this joke before, but making jokes with Isabeau makes you happy. Exactly. Some vials. You pick them up. Got some one super sour tonic. You give them the demonic for safekeeping. A kitchen closet. You open it. You found the egg key. You put the key in your pocket. The keychain dangling from it is shaped like an egg. Hmm. No time. <laughs> There's a house to explore. <laughs> Cookies. They're frozen in time. A pot filled with bubbling food, frozen in time. Steam is frozen in midair. So, what's inside? Ah. Looks like they were cooking crab. What? Crab, yeah, we found out last time that crab is apparently the worst you can eat. The worst thing ever in this universe. Crab? What's happening? Or maybe not the universe, but at least in this in this. Kingdom, I guess. Someone was cooking crab in a house of change of all places. Food tastes like crab. But literally. And and I think they, they say crab instead of crap as well. <laughs> Why would someone do this? I um Odia looks at you with question marks in her eyes. But crab is so tasty. You shrug. I'm very confused. Is this a Vogardian thing? Please don't tell me you eat crabs in Kabu, uh, Kabu if you don't think I could- I don't think I could handle it. Hmm. No, not really, but we don't have such an aversion to them. Hmm. Okay. Wait. Is it- Is this like dolphins? What about them? In Kabu, we don't like dolphins. Something about them being too smart. Are crabs smart? No, they're stupid and don't even walk right. Crabs just look weird, I think. Never actually thought about it. I thought it was like spiders. Every human thinks spiders look scary. Uh, Zala's afraid of spiders. N no, I'm, I'm a big strong man. <laughs> so, crabs are weird and don't walk right, okay. And they're inevitable. Inevitable? Uh-huh. I still don't understand anything. You also still don't understand anything. Vogard is weird. Vogard is weird. A sink and some kitchen utensils. Here! What? What is it? What? What's that? Is that an entire potato in the sink? What a waste. Oh, you stumbled. There was something there. You don't... You remember. Did this happen because whatever you found here before is already in your possession? <gasps> you feel dizzy. Yeah, because it, it kind of just fast-forwarded on its own. I didn't do anything. That was weird. It sucks, but you don't know for sure, because you could also... It could also be a body... Like, something you don't worry about sensitive, because you've had very limited food stuff that you eat. And now you're trying to get more stuff, but it gets hard when you don't really have the capacity to make food yourself. Or have a thing to... Hmm. 
And this beet chicken. <laughs> you don't want to keep trying to drink the juice or eat some food if you had to go to the bathroom for four hours and you're not even sure if it goes away. If you just need to get used to it or, uh, or something. Hmm. Yeah. Why is it so tall? Wait, hold on. We, we need. To, we don't need to do that. We've done that before. Yeah, I'm sorry. You have to uh, have to have so many issues with food and stuff, Ryan. Sadness has got all mixed up. Damn. Honestly, I'm just gonna use this. Ow. Damn. You can heal your. S no, she can't heal herself right now. I should be fine to use that, I think. Yeah. Uh. Don't need no mint. <laughs> Was, wasn't that one? Yeah, it was. It was when I played with Panda. <laughs> I don't remember in what context I said it, though. <laughs> I, I don't remember saying that, but it, it... Yeah. A row of spears. Why the need for an army and weapons in the... Wait, hold on. Yeah. An anvil, sharpening stone, and forge. Got crafted water. Oh, look on the wall. There's nothing. It's just a normal, boring wall. You don't stumble this time, but you feel dizzy still. Feel like in the air around you warped and changed for a second. Yeah, it's because we picked it up before. Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. Fine. She's gonna heal herself. I'm just gonna use that. Damn. 
Bonnie missed. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't. Let's, let's do that because I think it's gonna carry over to the next one, but I'm not entirely sure I'm not sure Getting used to this. Something was here before, but you always keep whatever weapons or armors you get through loops. Is the world rewriting itself when you look again? There's no glasses in there, but there are some supplies. You got a salty broth. Yeah. Some books on the house of change. And a book from the series The Cursing of Chateau Castle, issue 51. Issue 51? You should remember this number. It's a barrel. It's full of nothing. A tidy bed. Some vials. Um, it's filled with wax and candle making supplies. Smells nice. A tidy bed. There's bits of wax stuck under the covers. That's weird. Craftonomy book. Oh, this is a craftology book. Piercing craft. Creative craft. There's a protecting craft chapter. It's a craftonomy book, not a craftology book. This one is about the study of craft, not your fortune. Eh. Yeah, we've done this before as well. You like being able to be near them and not have to contribute to the conversation. Being silent and surrounded. Blah, 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 yeah. Instructions on how to craft candles. Unlike normal candles, it seems crafted candles last longer and can change smells as time goes by. Uh, some sort of candle making station? I have no idea what- yeah. I'm just looking for what I need to open up the door. So I'm just going through all of the, the stuff here pretty quick, quickly. But it's supposed to be in here. Some rolled up papers, you roll one. It's a bunch of sketches of landscapes. Oh my! The paper's filled with sketches of naked people doing fun things. You look at them curiously. Oh, oh my. Uh, neat. Show me, I, can, I can't see what it is. Oh no. No, no, no. Yeah, we, we've been through this before. A dresser with art books on top of it. You open the drawer. You found the broken egg key. A keychain dangling from it is shaped like an egg broken in half. You put the key in your pocket. In someone's drawer? What a weird place for a key, yeah. This is the key that I'm looking for. Yes. Pick a card at random, it's a card with a drawing of a star with an upside down face. Oops, you're holding the card upside down. This is a normal, uh, not upside down star. The bottom, unsurprisingly, says the star. You got the drawn card. You put the card in your pocket along with your souvenirs. A nice comfy looking bed. Some notes. The handwriting is so terrible you can barely read what's on it. Mm. Yeah, so we got what we needed, so we can move on. We can move on. And get to the door. Oh, damn. Did you skip the bling bling? Yeah, I did. I did. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna give the turn to... Odile. Because we need paper. Oh, damn. You can also do paper. Can respect the ding ding. <laughs> yeah, 
It's not here, I just wanted to make sure. This is where we're gonna go. Now we can reach towards the light. Everyone's healed. Your allies, craft skills, and experience has been recorded for this location. Save your progress, yes. Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. Sadness. It seems to be guarding the rest of the house from us. We feel strong. Stronger than those we've seen so far. Get ready, everyone. Did we do this last time? Oh yeah, we did. This is the one that changes uh, its type. Big ball head. <laughs> Big ball head. Wait, something's happening. Yeah. That was a rock sign. Yes, does this mean something? We can probably assume that it's current craft type. Yeah. Uh, so I'm gonna give the turn to Odile. So you can use paper. the enemy um yeah so i kind of just want to try to get the jackpot attack so i'm gonna guard sorry to rewatch watch again it's nice i also seen some videos about it on TikTok recently. Hmm. Nice, nice. Heal yourself. Give it to Mirabelle. So she can use... No, she can't... Oh, damn. Well, fine. Oh! I healed us. Are you okay to use it again now? No. Okay, she's just gonna guard. How about now? Yes. Oh, now it's immune. Did I miss? It changed the... Um... Oh, 
Well, it doesn't matter because I'm still gonna... I need five of the same attacks to be able to do the jackpot attack. So it doesn't matter if it's immune to it. Because I need to do it anyway. Well, it changed now. It didn't. It, it hadn't changed before. Well. At least we can do that. Well, next time we're gonna be able to do it, so might as well boost the attack. This better be worth it, though. <laughs> um, can I do that now? Is it is it time? No, it's not. Now, now we get it. Well, it's funny that it's immune to paper attack both before it changed type and after. I, I get it before it changed, but now, well, I mean, it changed to scissors, so it makes sense after, but not before, so I don't, I don't understand. So that was pointless. Um, <laughs> no, I mean, it started as rock and then changed to, to... No, but that's my point, that it was paper both before and after it changed. No, I mean, it, it was... It was immune to paper both before and after it changed. To... Uh, to scissor. So even before it changed to scissor, it was immune as well. That's what I was confused about because it makes no sense. If it's immune to the same and also the one it defeats. No, I think it's just supposed to be immune to the the one. Mm. Yeah, she can't do anything right now. No, shit! I didn't mean to guard. And you could actually do something now. <laughs> So now it changed to paper.
Yeah, I'm not gonna bother with the um, the jackpot attack. It won't be worth it anyway. I wasn't aware of the fact that she had used it. Um, I wasn't paying attention. She can't give her turn away. She's the only one who can't. No, I guess he also can't. But now we get a jackpot attack that should also do some damage. And it also heals us, so that's also good. Wonder if you will be able to do a run where only Bonnie's allowed to do damage after they start to do it. Mm. I mean, probably, but it would take ages, though. <laughs> if you just keep guarding, for example, or using um, passives and stuff. Um... But I... Yeah. Hey, Jean! Going to Lurk, got some tasks around the house, including finding food. And because, you know, I get curious, you're going to get pizza, cheese pizza. We'll keep tabbed. Thank you so much, Jean. I hope you're doing well. And also, thank you for uh, telling me what you're going to eat. <laughs> um... But yeah, so you should be able to, but it would take a long time. Cheetah? <laughs> Knew you'd ask. <laughs> I mean, I have to. It changes craft type, but you can't see anything. I'm gonna try with a, a scissor attack anyway, just to see. Okay. That means that it is... A rock. So we need paper. She also does paper attack. You had oven pizza from the... Fr <laughs> I did too. I usually have that during the weekend. Well, I mean, I didn't, I didn't today, but this weekend. That's just too good. It's just too good. Rude. Well, heal yourself. Ah. 
Nice. Nice! Uh... Yeah, just, just guard. Yeah, because she can still use the regular attack. Mm. I think I'm a bit lower level doing this fight than I was the first time. That's why it's taking so long. Oh. Well, at least it heals every everyone, even if it is immune to it. So that means that it's weak against Scissor, I, I would assume. Got it now. There we go. There we go. Um, do you think it would be worth to try to kill all the enemies? Uh, probably not. <laughs> Sifrin is now level 48 and learned the craft skill buy one, get one, three. <laughs> Mirabel is now level 46. Isabel is 46. Odile is level 46. We did it! Victory! Alright, let's keep moving. I'm just gonna... Something's... Oh, I can't... Okay. Okay, fine. Wait, does that mean that we all healed up after that? Oh yeah, I guess we did after leveling up. How they don't start a, as level one because they have been adventuring before this, it's very nice detail. Mm. I mean, the only reason why you would want to uh, heal up, no, I mean, um, kill everything, I mean, <laughs> is if you need to, if you feel the need to grind and stuff. And I, I am not a fan of that. <laughs> I also won't, won't skip a bunch of stuff, though. Um, when I played... Amori, I pretty much killed everything, <laughs> and I was so OP. <laughs> um, I, like most fights were super easy because I had just killed everything that came in my path. But here, everything respawns just when you enter a room or like leave a room and then re-enter the room. So it's just. 
it will be very tedious. This room feels very different than the others, doesn't it? It's missing the threatening pressure the rest of the house has. Shall we take a little break then? N no, we should keep going and... What was that? I think I'm hungry. And my time, my time. My time to be the leader. Why? Because it's snacks time, baby. Snacks are important to keep hunger away and keep morale up. I learned that because I'm a growing kid. That sure is true. But do we have time to... Mira. Let's take a break, alright? Even people blessed by the change god like you need to take a break sometimes. Alright. Okay, we're gonna change- we're gonna choose something different this time, like food-wise. You guys stay here. I'll get some snacks ready. Okay, snack leader. Oh, I remember something. Isabel. That's your tails. Huh? Um... Tails. Odile takes a coin from her pocket and flips it in the air. Flip, flip, flip. Flip. <laughs> it fell on heads. Heads? The last time, didn't it? Huh. Oh, too bad. Interesting. You now owe me. We were betting? You now owe me a thousand. A thousand what? Books. Books? <laughs> Ugh, can't believe this. Betrayed by, betrayed by a friend. We're not friends. We're associates. Not companions. Colleagues. Allies, at best. Not even soulmates? Yeah, not even soulmates. Like, that is like... The bare minimum. Can't believe you've gone down to being an acquaintance now. No! <laughs> what was the coin flip about, madame? Ah, well, I asked the favor tree to make me win my next coin flip. Huh? Such a silly favor. Surely for scientific reasons. I was wondering whether this favor tree business had any truth to it. As we can see, it does. That wasn't the best experiment to prove it. There's a 50 50 uh, there is a 50 50 percent chance after all you don't believe you won thanks to the favor tree not really call me weird but I don't think a tree can grant favors but Madame Odile didn't care about what she was asking so why would the favor tree care huh if you want something to come true it definitely will you think so absolutely you're glad to see Bonnie smile again. Okay, who wants snacks? I have snacks. Today I have many snacks at your disposal. I have some plantain chips. Oh, did you use the last of those not bananas to make them? <laughs> yes. Yes, I did. Crunchy, delicious, and full of potassium. That's plantain chips. You all clap. Second snack is some boring but delicious cookies. Cookies! Yeah, I wanted to pick cookies last time. And then I, I chose onigiri. Great sales pitch, Bonbon. Bon. Boring but delicious. Cookies, the taste of home. Cookies are never boring. We established this last time. Hey, old crow! <laughs> Speaking of soulmates. Yeah, you and Chris, you, um... You, 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 uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wait, what is that clip? Oh, oh, I see. It's, it's before the opera house, isn't it? Yeah. Don't slip on them. Yeah, don't slip on the banana peels or the plantain peels. Um... Got a very small murder on the go. Mm. <laughs> I'll be doing well, the old crow. Boring but delicious cookies, the taste of home. What kind of home is boring but delicious? Is not you weird? And for our third and final snack, we are proud to present um some um oginiri, onigiri, orinigi, onigiri. Onion Giri. You messed that one up on purpose. Yes. <laughs> I have some onigiris for everyone. One of those Kabuan rice balls, right? Yeah. 
Rice. I love rice. You and every other kid on this planet, Boniface. Hm. Now, choose. Choose which one you want. Don't worry, I have enough for everyone. You like... Yeah, so we had onigiri last time. I'm gonna pick cookies this time. You finally got your PC working again and watching on PlayStation 5 sucks. Hmm. I can imagine, yeah. There's also a little bit of a lag when it comes to watching on, on console, I've noticed. Onion Giri sounds delicious. <laughs> but I'm glad your PC is working, though. That's good. I'll take a cookie. There. You. Go. Me as well, please. Bonnie hands you and Mirabel a few cookies. Delicious, delicious cookies. Boring, but you could never get sick of them. Why would people say that cookies are boring? I just, I don't understand. It's good. You can never go wrong with cookies. I think. <laughs> so, do you all like it? Did I do a good job as a as snack leader? Do not, but prepare yourself for what comes next. Yeah, this is good. Mm hmm Uh, um, you say very loudly. Thank you, snack leader, for this delicious meal. Oh, this is so good. Thank you, Bonnie. Mmm, so good, Bon Bon. I feel refreshed, invigorated, alive. Hmm. <laughs> Look at the faces. Mmm, <laughs> good food. Yummy, yum, yum. Yes! The result of the coin flip was different this time. So things related to chance, chance are random. Good to know. After eating your snacks, everyone's health has been restored. I mean, it was restored already because we leveled up. It's all stupid. You can't be friends. It'll be like being friends with your mom or your sister. So then, which one is Odile? Hmm. Actually, Odile's more like a grandma, isn't she? You definitely can't be friends with your grandma. Is that how it works? I wanna... <laughs> which one is Mira? Belle's like a cool sister. The one who's, who'd give me sweets when I ask. I like my actual older sister who sucks. Hmm. Which one is Isa? Hmm. It's almost like a little brother. <laughs> Except he's like, he could be, he could be almost their dad, I, I guess. Which one am I? You're, um, I don't know. Damn. Hope everyone is alright. The people in the house? Yes. Well, they're most likely all frozen in time, aren't they? We haven't seen anyone yet, but maybe, maybe someone survived. Maybe the head housemaiden managed to... Tell me a joke, Sifrin, please. To get my mind off things. Joke time. I had a meeting with a plum today. A plum? Like the fruit? Yes, that meeting was fruitful. <laughs> you finished the joke quickly to make sure she wouldn't finish it herself. <laughs> what? Oh, fruitful. I guess that's funny. <laughs> she guesses. Failure. Yeah. They don't like puns in this game. Except, well, I mean, except the, to the two best characters. But everyone else hates puns. Hey, Sif. Let me guess. You're still hungry. I can see it on your face. Want half of this cookie? Isabel waves his last cookie at you. Yes. Yes, please, Mr. Amazing, Wonderful, Funny, Buff, Isabeau. <laughs> we know that this is what it's gonna lead to anyway. <laughs> ah. What? Isabeau was so surprised by what you said. He destroyed the cookie he was holding into a thousand crumbs. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, that that's the one. <laughs> oh, that's sad, though. No, not the cookie. Sif, you can't just say that. I really have the heart of a delicate maiden, you know? <laughs> oh, 
have you have to be careful with me. <laughs> okay, next time we know we need to we need to we need to be gentle with Isabeau. Poor guy, he's also devastated that the cookie was destroyed. Oh, I would be too, honestly. Hmm. Hope I didn't make Bonnie upset earlier. You both look Bonnie's way. Bonnie's stuffing their cheeks happily. Never mind. <laughs> Ugh. Hey. Isabel seems to have trouble looking you in the eye. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> uh, I went a bit too too uh too too extreme on that one. <laughs> but you got you guys laughed. I'm glad. I'm glad. You reach towards the light. Everyone was healed. Your allies' craft skills and experience has been recorded for this location. See your progress? Yes. You close your eyes. And we save. Are you ready? Yes, ready. All right, let's go. Let's go. Uh... Yeah, the enemies here are stronger, if I remember correctly. Um, oh yeah, this is where the house maiden was frozen. Or one of them, I don't know. Is that someone from the house? Frozen? Yeah, we're just gonna skip that. Because it wasn't anything important about... Oh yeah, that's true. We there there's like a, a rock that breaks the um, the doorway there, I think. Wait, I I don't think you've seen this one. What? I haven't seen this one before. Buy one, get one three. That's what we got. Yeah, we got this one when we leveled up. Deals three sister hits uh, to one enemy. Hit high chance of doing a critical hit to- Yeah, but this is not the one to do that on. Ow. Okay, so... The big one is weak again, so they probably have the opposite attacks then, or weaknesses. Interesting. Let's see. Let's try with the that one then. Wait. So it's weak against Sisser then? Okay. But it says zero. Doesn't mean that we can't do any damage to the other one until the big one is dead. Probably. Hmm. Also, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. We do have anonymous follows, by the way. Um. As two enemies, yeah. The other one is uh, kind of invisible. Hmm. 
There we go. Devil is now vulnerable. Yeah, it was what I what I thought. I think it was weak against Scissor. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. No, stop attacking her. I mean, it might not be necessary, but I'm gonna do it anyway. There we go. 500, that's pretty good. Um, Let me heal up a little bit. Uh, yeah, I don't think I need to do anything else. No, maybe Sifrin. We can give more to Sifrin as well. Let's see. We're ready for it this time. You'll be fine looking at old spots like this from now on. Something's weird. Huh? Something's weird? Like what? I'll let you know when I find out. There's some gardening books about rare and powerful plants. None of them catch your eye. Hmm, maybe Odile is on to us. <laughs> what happened last time? Wait, what do you mean? I don't think there was anything... No, maybe? This time you read... Yeah, it's it's what has been happening whenever I've been interacting with um, stuff that has given me... Items that don't get removed. Like, not non-consumable items. So, if I've gotten a new weapon, for example, then it doesn't appear there again later. But it will buy... Like... It's like there's nothing there anymore. And then it made me dizzy. It happened- it has happened like three or four, four times now, I think, today. Um... Oh, that's- wait, yeah, we're, not, we're just gonna skip that. You try your best to pass through the tight space between your allies, the tables, and the wall. As you pass through, you realize, not for the first time in the situation, that everyone unconsciously makes sure to not touch you any more than necessary. It's not the best feeling, but there must be a reason they're not touching you, so you leave it alone. <laughs> That's funny. Um, A tiny dying plant. This plant looks tiny and cute. Let's say that, because we didn't say that last time. I guess. No, it's not. No, no, I see what Sif means. There's a ch certain charm to it. It's cute. Hope he grows up to be big and strong. He better. You hear me, plant? I believe in you. Grow big and strong. You smile. <laughs> um. Did you say it would deal my be like suspecting something maybe i don't know i'm not sure but they did notice that something was off or she i just know that the the door will be blocked if i continue oh this is one we haven't seen before Anxiety. <laughs> Anxiety. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell what this one is supposed to be. Is it... Is it supposed to be Scissor? I'm not sure.
Let's see. I'm gonna try with Odile because... Let's see. Oh, okay, so it is Scissor. <laughs> um... No, not heal. Oh no, it takes... Is it a bomb? Is it gonna explode? I know this probably won't do anything. But I'm just gonna do it anyway. Simply because... Yeah, it resists because it's scissor. Oh, it explodes. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. So that's how it works. <laughs> that's how it works. Are we getting an ad? I'm not gonna do anything during the ad break, by the way. Um, This reminds me of Amori. That's exactly why I wanted to play it, because it also reminds me of Amori. <laughs> well, now we know how that works. Um, so next time I'm gonna make sure that I use resist. No, guard, I mean. And next time I'm gonna make sure that I use guard. <laughs> um, well, even if there is an ad break, I'm just gonna spend that time healing. Drink that heals 40% of everyone's HP. It makes you do a kissy face when you drink it. Yeah, because it's super sour. Mirabel only has two health. Damn. I'll just do it. Um, pizza is en route to you. That's good. That is good. I also want like I had I had food before stream though, but <laughs> it's like pizza is always good. It's always good. Uh, all got so low on Mira. Well, even die. No, no, no. They didn't. She didn't die. No, she had two health. Um, she had two. Luckily, so we haven't we haven't had anyone die. Well, except my character because it's like it's part of the. How the game works, but we haven't had anyone actually die in fight in a fight yet. So that's good. Let, let's try to keep it that way. Um, but the portrait even changed. Mm, I didn't see that. Maybe maybe it's something that happens when you super super low on health that you almost dead. Uh, no, you're trying to get Panda in chat? <laughs> uh, I haven't seen Panda in so long. Well, I mean, he did pop by, uh, in, in Discord, though. But I haven't- he hasn't been here in a while, but it's because he's- Well, he has to- he has to live with his parents for a little bit now, and they apparently have really bad internet. Hold on, I'm just gonna turn on the light here. So that sucks. <laughs> so <pizza. laughs> <All right. laughs> Thank you for gifting a sub to Ananas on Pizza. On on Pizza. <laughs> Thank you, Ryan. The ad breaks are over. Oh, we haven't been here because we did I don't think we managed to get here last time before we died. Uh very school supplies. 
a desk. On it is an open issue of The Cursing of Chateau Castle, issue 32. Issue 32? You should remember this number. Yeah, we have found issue 51 and 32 now. A desk. On it is a notebook titled Mark's Super Awesome Great Amazing Super Duper Cool Notebook Do Not Touch. Out of respect, you leave the Super Duper Cool Notebook alone. Well, you're better than me. No, just kidding. Some vials. Let's see. You got super sweet tonic. Give it to Bonnie for safekeeping. A desk with an open notebook. It has very lovely handwriting. Oh, I recognize this handwriting. This is the seat of a very stylish, very scary, scary lady with amazing fashion sense. She often wore this very cool dress, and she always has her dark hair in a bun. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ryan, do you remember this person? I think it's the one that uh, is kind of idolizing Mirabelle, and Mirabelle doesn't remember her. And then you get the chance to... Now we get the chance to tell her that Mirabelle actually knows who she is. I think that was like a point of, of the thing. We often had the same classes, but she probably doesn't know I exist. Yes, she does. But you didn't know. She, you, she thought you didn't know. <laughs> I'm a little sad about it. I always wanted to ask her for fashion tips. This vaguely rings a bell. You should maybe tell Mirabelle about her when you're in Dormont. Yes. See? Dude, this is a good game for, for me and, and my memory. Like, sure, I have had a few things that I haven't remembered today. Because it's been a few weeks since the last time I played this game. But still. <laughs> uh, you're in the past and it does show Mirabelle's your HP and even the skull icon is there and her picture changed. Interesting. Hmm. I wonder why it says 2, two HP then. The bookcase is filled with some books about many, many random things. There's a book about something called Bonding Earrings. I wonder what that's about, but not enough to pick up the book. You know, that's a mood. <laughs> a pile of students' papers. A list of students' names for a month-long class. Some of the students have more than their first and last name listed. Huh. A student has one, two, five names? This is a Vogardian practice, as I recall. Having more than one name? Yeah. A lot of Vogardians have more than one name. Usually it's one masculine name, one feminine name, and a free one for good measure. I kind of like that. But some parents just go wild and give more than that. I had a co-worker with ten names. Damn. The many names represent our capacity for change, our power to evolve, to become someone new at a moment's notice. And if you decide to change genders or become some someone different than who you were before, you already have a name ready to pick out. Hmm. Yeah. This is lovely, actually. A Volgard's goal of change goes even as deep as names. I have another name, too, so I feel a little closer to Volgard at this moment. You do? I want to know. I want to know. I'm curious as well. If that's okay. Hmm. If you tell me yours, I might. Unless that's your... Unless that's frowned upon. Not really frowned upon. But some people might keep it secret for personal reasons. That's why not everyone on the student list wrote down every name, see? I wouldn't mind telling you, though, Madame Odile. I'd tell you, but I forgot mine. My sister is the one who remembers. Imagine not remembering your name, but your family members do, but you don't. Hmm, I'm gonna pass. I wanna keep them secret. Because if I do change again, I don't want you to already know who to, uh, how to call me. I want it to be a surprise. Oh, of course. Now let us keep our name secret for a little while longer. Vogard is so weird. <laughs> um, Maybe gave her 2 HP because like she was in the party with you after the fight. You don't know because it's not... Absolute death. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> what happened? Uh, we we just 
They were talking about names. The statue of the change god. It's been destroyed. A note stuck to the wall. It says, no snack eating in this room. Out of the uh, corner of your eye, you see Bonnie chomp on an apple. Yeah, but no one will know. A board with some doodles in the corner. It's a nice classroom, isn't it? I wonder what classes were taught here. Hmm. I have bad memories of this classroom. Why? Did you have a bad class in this room, Belle? Uh, no, not... Um, it's... I gave a class here not too long before the king attacked. You're a teacher? <gasps> you never said. N no. It was just one lecture. I am um, the head housemaiden. She said it would be good for me to give a lecture. A lecture on... I'm... I'm well known in Dormont's house for being the housemaiden who was taken... Who has taken the most classes? <laughs> taken the most classes? Like, as a student? How many is that? Uh, since I came to live here, I think I registered for... A little more than 150 classes? Damn. Huh? Mirabelle? You went to school that long? So she wanted me to do a lecture. On what taking all those classes taught me. And? And? Should we drop it? Yes, please. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Some school books. Mathematics, geography, crafting, art, sewing, cooking. Okay. Um... <laughs> the Seribot is really good. Some frozen flowers. They smell like flowers. Okay, so it's there there isn't really anything else in here. Maybe it's like fainting situation. Was there like option to wake them mid fight if someone got Yeah, but Yeah. I guess you don't die die. Okay, so this is paper, it seems. Paper! Oh, damn. No. She's gonna, gonna, gonna heal him. No, damn, she could have used she could have used paper as well. Oh well. It's fine. You know, I know that it's supposed to be resistant to rock, but it it just Yeah, it did it did a lot of damage anyway. <laughs> What if it's immune to... No, it's probably immune to that, to that. So, well, I mean, we can try. Oh. Never mind then. <laughs> it wasn't immune to anything. <gasps> A sadness. Another weird one. Like the one that gave us the crest? Wait, Boniface? What do you mean by... Wait, wait. No time, madame. Let's get ready. I'm also confused. Okay, so it did... Um, it did rock damage, it seems. No? Let's see. I think paper is what we need to use here. I just wanted to see. 
Oh no. Maybe it's... Let's try with rock then. Okay, rock is the way to go. Give it to Isabel. And then you're gonna heal yourself. Rude. is better than nothing. Damn. Okay. 1100. That's pretty good. Got a star crest. Put the star crest in your pocket. Yay, another crest. We should be careful about where we use this one. I mean... Weren't we careful about the last one, too? There's a note on the wall. It says, Stop eating nuts directly from the barrels. But I didn't eat anything. Nah, it's not worth using that one. But I don't have that many. I'm just gonna heal Odile. Um, got new Crocs finally the other day when you went to the new store. Nice. What color? Nostalgia was the name. Was the other name that? No, I mean, they have- they have a lot of, um... They're called sadnesses, so it's like they have... Like, names tied to emotions, but usually, like... Not happy emotions, really. He always shaped like a hand in the paper position. Interesting. So we have to come back here then. God damn it. That was a specific one. Yeah, I think the same name. The, the other one had the same name. Okay, this seems to be Scissor. Oh yeah. Give your turn to Odeal. Uh, but the first store you were before you didn't buy because we're in blue ones and you didn't want to get that day then so you in the new store ah I see I see so we got black ones I actually wore my crocs today for the the first time in in a long time 47.
Ah. Okay, let's continue the... the blah, blah, blah. I don't want to deal with that now. I just wanted to make sure. The first crocs that are too small and broken years ago are lime, are lime green. They got you got them very young. Mm. Wait, how did I get full health? I'm not- I'm not gonna complain about that. <laughs> no, 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 not attack. Um... There we go. <laughs> Don't deal with sadness right now. Not right now. Sorry, Sifrin. I just... It's just over there. That's the head housemaiden's office. Someone like her definitely has some good stuff, right? Like keys. Like snacks. Like information. Let's go then. You let yourself be led. <sighs> but last time we couldn't... Yeah, we need, to, we need to make sure that we get everything here before we leave. Because... Last time there was a rock that ended up blocking the path and we needed a key in here, I think. You don't even remember when you got them, but have been using them to this day with some time between not used because you didn't. Hmm. <laughs> would be nice to punch sadness away. Yeah, yeah, it would be. I use that with sleep. I I punch the sadness away with sleep if I'm I'm sad. How <laughs> far? Well, I think we had to. I think we had to use a tea or something to die because we couldn't progress because we needed the key from this room right here. And I think Mirabel remembered that there was a key in the desk, but she remembered after the path was blocked by a big rock. So we had to die, and that's how we ended stream last time. A pile of papers. You take one at random. It looks like boring administ administrative papers. A childish drawings of a tall, bright woman. Some notes about the king. The head housemaiden must have been looking for more information about him. Why do you even call the king the king? Wait, we've, we've done this before. Well, God is so weird. A closet is full of boring administrative papers. A statue of the change god. It's been destroyed. A change ornament. The bookcase is filled with books about various subjects. Various boring subjects. You leave the bookcase alone. Uh, a pillar. The head housemaiden's massive desk drawer. You start looking for the key. So this is the office of head housemaiden of the House of Dormont. She's wonderful. The man, uh, she manages the house and makes sure everyone is happy and fulfilled. She organizes a lot of events too. She's also a great crafter. She always creates wonderful items that makes everyone's lives easier. She taught me so much. Most of the craft skills I know I learned from her. She was the one, wasn't she? The one who was supposed to... Yes. She's the one who was supposed to defeat the king. But the king was too strong and attacked out of nowhere, and now I don't know what happened to her. When I fled the house, the king might have already... Don't worry, Mira. If she's that strong, I'm sure we'll find her safe and sound, and sound eventually. Yeah. Positive. I have to stay positive. 
all stars. There was a key hidden in there. It was taped to the underside, so you missed it before. You blinding idiot. You found the rock key. The keychain dangling from it is shaped like a hand in the rock position. How fitting. You put the key in your pocket. You now know where the rock key is located. Yeah, and we also seen a door with uh, a hand shaped like paper. Some paper and ink. On the paper, you can see a spreadsheet of some kind. There's two columns, one filled with names, while the other only has one or two. The first full column is titled Save Ogard. The second near empty column is titled Other. What could this be about? Some frozen flowers. They smell like flowers. Yeah, this is what happened last time. There was nothing important in there, right? So this is fine. What a waste of time. At least we didn't get squashed, though. And then she remembered afterwards that, oh, the key was in the desk. And then we just had to die by the, the tear there. Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. So this is as far as we've gotten. We have never been past this door before. Is this the house hate? Uh, a house maiden? Someone frozen in time. Oh, this is... I don't know. I've seen them around sometimes. I think they're someone's partner? Someone's bonded partner, even. Look at their earrings. Aren't they bonding earrings? You look at them. Their left ear has a beautiful dark dangling earring. And the right ear, a simple and transparent one. Are those bonding earrings? You're not familiar with what that is. The earrings have different but complementary designs. How romantic. I wonder which half is theirs. I feel like the clear one represents them better, so maybe that's the one their partner made. Do you think we'll see their partner somewhere in the house? Yes. They might have been looking for each other when the king attacked. If you manage to beat the king, they get back to normal and look for their partner. They'd start running, trying to find them. Flower petals in their wake. And then, they'd see each other from across the hallway, eyes locking. They'd take one step forward, hesitantly, wondering if this is real. And then... And then they trip on a brick and break their nose. Yeah, sure. What a... See? See? <laughs> it's just trying to ruin everything. Let's get... And their partner, seeing the blood, would faint, would faint in horror. And then they'd feel so bad they made their partner faint. They would exile themselves in shame. Ah, yes. How romantic. It's not! Stop crushing our dreams! Yeah, I, I agree. Stop. Stop ruining things. What's a bonding earring? You suppose it's not very important, but... The next step will be the first <laughs> furthest I've ever been from home. Yeah, yeah. If I take one more step, Mr. Frodo. You thought someone was going to say got squashed by a rock? Hmm. The bookcase is filled with various novels. How to not make a fool of yourself. A journey. Tick. Soul Emperor. F um, four. Soul Emperoring. And the Cursing of Chateau Castle, issue 40 to 48. Issue 48. You should remember this number. The bookcase is filled with uh, theater scripts. You gently touch the back of a Vogardian comedy you remember liking. Oh, don't worry, Sif. You'll be able to see some play soon. So there's... There's something I've always wondered. What is it, Bonnie? Well, um... You know that stage play friend brought us to? Before we got the last orb to open the house? In it, the main characters. The two men kissed on, on the mouth, right? <laughs> ah. Oh, gems. Shush, I want to hear this. And so, um... When people kiss on the mouth in place, they don't really kiss, right? 
I have some transparent paper in between so their lips don't touch, right? <laughs> what? What? Uh, uh what? <laughs> yeah, Bonnie, they definitely have paper in between. Huh? Yeah, I knew it. No one would ever kiss someone on the mouth in a play. Not in front of everyone. Not in front of everyone. <laughs> Oh, that's really good. Boniface, this is why you're my favorite. Woohoo! Damn. Yeah. There's a video someone made doing that, like she says it every time. Yeah, you've mentioned that before. The video was very long. Mm. <laughs> There's a crumpled poem on the ground. You pick it up. You got the crumpled poem. You put it. You put the poem in your poke po poke it, by the way, in pocket along with your souvenirs. <gasps> is there a key here? Because it's sparkling here. The bookcase is filled with random books, from novels to picture books to massive research essays. You see the side of the bookcase shine slightly. There must be a key somewhere. Maybe inside one of the books. Which book should you examine? Steppy Steppy Cooking. Efforts, the key to meaningful change. Running from your problems. Like, running from your problems. Pass. Okay, we're gonna do effort, the key to meaningful change. You open the book. Yep. Inside the book, title Effort, the key to meaningful change. There's a key. Pretty on the nose. See, it's because, you know, I know. I know what they're going for here. You found the paper key. The keychain dangling from it is shaped like a hand in the paper position. You put the key in your pocket. You now know there where the paper key is located. Indeed. Um You would have taken the running without thinking. <laughs> the bookcase is filled with random books from novels to picture. Uh, which book should be? we can look at the other ones though. Steppy Steppy Cooking. You open the book. The book falls open on a recipe for some kind of kabu and dumplings. Dumplings! Oh, those are called gyozas, Bonnie Face. Gyozas! Do you, how do you make them? Please stop screaming. Sorry! Sorry. How do you make them? Bonnie looks intently at the recipe. Huh. Oh, okay. Oh, that's crabbing easy. Our tiny little adorable chef's at it again. What? Oh, sorry. We can go. I, I can look at it later. No, it's fine. You might as well look at it now. Okay. My sister, she, um... What about your sister, Bonnie? It... It doesn't matter. Can we go now? You all look sadly at Bonnie and try to keep moving. Let's look at the last book. Running from your problems. You open the book. This book seems to me about how to get a better running posture and better endurance. Madame Odile could use this book, huh? What does that mean? Just that you're not very fast, is all. And you get tired easily, too. Maybe if you kids could stop running everywhere you go. Huh. Uh-huh, Sifrin. You quickly look away from her glare. <laughs> it's okay, Odile. I can teach you how to run good. Yes, madame. Take lessons from the kid who puts their arms straight behind them while running. Like a Naruto run? <laughs> I want to see you do it. It is a very interesting way to run, Bonnie. But why? Another kid in Bamboosh said running like that was ergonomic. Ergonomic, yeah. Ergonomic? I don't know that Vogardian word. Me neither. What's it mean? Um, it means, it, it means the wind doesn't matter and I can go fast. <laughs> it's ergonomic. <laughs> ah, do you mean ergonomic? Do I? I hope not. That's not how you use that word. It's not? Nope. But running like that makes me faster. Does it? It does. Okay. So Deal should run like this too. I'd rather not. Aww. <laughs> uh, it's all about being aerodynamic. Yeah, I think that's what they were going for. The bookcase is filled with books about the house of change. 
So the house of change is the name of the belief, but the house is the name of the place. And there's more than one house in Volgard. And a house is where people live. Such a confusing language. N no, it's not so bad. It makes sense. Hmm. If you'd like to know more about the house of change, yes, recommend me a book. But let's be quick about it. Okay. Okay. Yes. All right. I think you should try this one. The life-changing magic of changing yourself. This one is a little abstract, but it is all about our beliefs and the change god. Living while striving for change within ourselves, while keeping our ever-changing god in our thoughts. This book ex explains pretty well the belief that a lot of the people of Vogard live by. Hmm. Interesting that you only have one deity. Easy to keep track of, I suppose. Oh yeah, what do you have in Kabu then? We have... Gods? Spirits? Expressions? The nuance gets a little lost in Volgardian. Expressions for every everything. So how many expressions do you have then? A dozen? A few thousand? Huh. What? So many! Do you have to keep track of all of them? Of course not. You only have to pray to the ones that you need. So for me, the expression of search, the expression of writing, the expression of creator craft, and lately, the expressions of battle and victory, I suppose. Cool. It's pretty neat. Hope the expressions and the change god bless us in our journey. Yeah, because, like, she's supposed to be from, like, Japan. Or, like, their equivalent of Japan. And that's how, how it is there. Like, they have spirits for, for so many different things. <laughs> the bookcase is filled with notebooks <clears throat> of all... <clears throat> Shapes and sizes. <laughs> they look kind of out of place here. You point at them and look at Mirabelle. Oh, they're diaries, Sifrin. Diaries in a library? Oh yeah, you guys do that in Dormont too. It's popular in Jovent as well. So, so... You know how our belief encourages change, right? Sometimes when people change, they might not feel any attachment to the people they were before. Or they might want any trace of who they were to just disappear from their sight. And so, some houses let it widely known that you can give away items that remind you too much of who you were. Like diaries. But those items, aren't they given away to, the, uh, to be disposed of? Most items are, but diaries in particular are usually kept by houses. It's common knowledge, though. I personally find it weird. Even if I change that much, I wouldn't want people to read my thoughts. It's more of a gesture, right? Letting go of your past self. Names and any obvious sig signifiers are erased by the house anyway. But mostly, it's about history. Isn't it fun to be able to pick up a diary written by someone a very long time ago? See big historical events from their perspective? More than giving away a part of who you were, I think a lot of people actually give their diaries away, so it's like... Look, Mom, I wrote a book that's in a library. Huh. I can understand that, then. Huh. The idea of anyone reading your de deepest thoughts, even years in the future, completely removed from you. Gross. Again, Volcard is weird. But also, you love drama, so you happily pick this, the <laughs> gaudiest, sparkliest diary you see. See, this is <laughs> this is what I would do. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this one looks fairly recent. We could read a little bit, like a tiny bit. We do not have time. Is what I would usually say. But I'd also love to think about boring, mundane, everyday problems for a bit. Dear diary, save us from thinking about our problems. Well, pick a page. One page, and then we're going. Uh, I'm, I'm reading again? Okay, hmm. Everyone huddles around her. Mirabelle takes a deep breath and opens it straight in the middle. Okay. Mom told me to clean my room today. I hate cleaning my room. My room, my room isn't even dirty. Why doesn't she understand? Ugh. Also, Dad noticed no one can say the name of the island north of here anymore. I tried to say it yesterday, 
and I got like the weirdest headache for hours. I might trick my friends into saying it tomorrow. The rest is just doodles of a little girl laughing un uproarish uh, up uproariously. <laughs> uproariously. <laughs> oh, the island north of Vogard. I remember when it happened. Well, remember isn't the right word, is it? We all just know something happened. An entire stretch of land disappearing from people's mind doesn't happen often, does it? I think... I think my village was really close to it. My sister said it was all everyone could talk about for weeks. That's so frightening. I'm glad that whatever happened, she didn't get caught up in it. Oh, yeah. Still, the country's name... Was it... Uh, what's his, what was its name again? See, they have, they have a typo. It's not... Or, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to correct the game, okay? <laughs> what was its name again? Oh, I think it was something like... Don't say it. Crab. <laughs> the name was Crab? Huh? What an inter interesting diary entry. You kind of wish you could document more about your life. You've never been good at doing, like, diary stuff. Same. I used to do it a lot before, when I was, like, in my early... I don't know, pre-teens or early teens. I'm not sure. <sighs> but keeping it up, like, every single day is really difficult. And when you don't do it regularly, you just kind of fall off and then you just stop completely and then getting back into it is really difficult. So then it's like, yeah, I stopped. This wall feels different somehow, but you don't see any switches or anything, so you leave it alone. A book that seems a little too heavy for the table it's on. This book is massive. It's called The Complete History of Fishing. Hmm. Odile takes the book with two hands and hits the table with it. Is this the 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 button to open the 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 wall wall with? Do that again. Please. Crab yeah. Ah, huh, indeed. I'll take this one. Odile got the heavy book. Oh, maybe that's- we just need to smash the wall with it. She puts it in her pocket to equip later. A fishing book. A fishing olo- It's called- Ichthyology. Ichthyology? And I'm not studying it. Ooh. Yeah, they're trying to figure out what Odile is studying because she hasn't said- told anyone. Some vials. Let's see. You got two sweet tonics. You give them to Bonnie for safekeeping. Why couldn't these... Uh, I, I, I assume maybe it had something to do with crabs. <laughs> A pile of lists of books that have been checked out for the library. Odile is looking intently at the list. The statue of the change god, it's been destroyed. Okay, let's try to see if we can smash the wall now. Let's see. Or maybe. Can she use it as a weapon? Oh yeah, this is definitely better. You can knock someone out with it. It's a weapon. Boosts attack, but plus one cooldown to all craft skills. Hmm. Sure. Irish, how you doing? Traveler's hat, that's always the answer. 
<laughs> welcome in, welcome in. Um, wait, have you played this game before? Never? Okay. <laughs> oh, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. I forgot to... No, I didn't. I didn't forget. Oh, damn. You saw me in Cozy Street? Yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. We, we, we're doing, we're doing uh, some, some gaming in here as well. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm gonna give the turn to... Isabeau. gonna guard I think and you're gonna actually you know I mean, it's gonna explode on its own anyway. What is the point? Why? I should just guard. Yeah. <laughs> it did enough damage. That's for sure. <laughs> Guess it's but he's. Oh no. I'm just trying to skip uh, some of them. But we have the one to the door um, that was locked before. So we can open it now. Welcome in, welcome in. Hold on, let me just give you a shouty outy. Oh, never mind. Orion did it. <laughs> welcome in. What were you doing? You were playing Hades too? Thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. Hope you had a good stream. And uh, anyone who is new here, welcome in. Welcome in. Uh, just gonna do a quick introduction. Uh, my name is Repikos. I'm a Norwegian streamer. I'm currently playing a game called In. I was gonna say in space and time <laughs> in stars and time. It's a really good game. It's a really good game um, I enjoy I enjoy usually I play Elden Ring as well um, and I've, I've I love Baldur's Gate 3 as well, <laughs> so I played that quite a bit and uh, Yeah, we're playing a lot of indie games in here as well, so I hope I hope you you enjoy sticking around but if not that is totally understandable um but how was your stream van witcher i hope you had a good time hope you had a good time um see you also play a lot of uh wait are you talking about indie games i love indie games <laughs> i mostly play indie games <laughs> oh yeah unfinished ball just get yeah um nor elden ring mm. but you do like them you do like them Everything I said. Okay, well, that's the, that's that's even better. That's even better. Um, but yeah, I I I finished Baldur's K three on on stream twice. Uh, so now I'm just I just need to do an honor mode run on stream, and then then I've completed my mission. <laughs> just a long um, 
So you turn to indie? Mm. That's true. That is true. They are pretty long games. Um, are you excited to start Near Automata tomorrow? Ooh, I see, I see. I couldn't really get into the game. I've tried playing it twice. And... But it, it just it just looks so good. Those who seek danger <laughs> over cheese don't tend to live as long. Very true, Gail. Very true. But thank you for the 30 Those. bits, Ryan. Yeah, Ryan. <laughs> uh, but yeah, also, if you have been in, in the raid now, uh, obviously, if you need to raid and run and do your own thing and relax and stuff, feel free to do so. But also, you're very welcome to hang out and, and chill if you want to do that, too. Though, oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. Uh, it starts over. Okay, so what she should do is she should actually use. We should we should use this one. Yeah. Um you followed already, by the way, and your chat is kinda sleepy because they're sleepier <laughs> Europeans. <laughs> Wait, but how did you find my stream? Because I, I don't think like it says that it's your first time chatting, so I thought you just randomly found my stream right now and I don't know how, but I will, I'm, usually I tend to ask people like, "How did how did you find the stream?" Because I'm 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 nosy, <laughs> I'm nosy, but that's totally understandable. Yeah, I'm I'm also in in Norway, so it is almost midnight. So I, I totally understandable that people are sleeping now or getting ready to go to sleep when it's the week the the regular weekday. You don't remember, but you just checked the follow list. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Well, I appreciate it. You could have raided anyone and you decided to raid me. I appreciate that. Maybe we know someone mutual. Could be. Could be. That could very well be. <laughs> I know, I know, I like, I know so many different people from different communities on, on Twitch, so it's hard to say. Sleep is for the sleepy. Yeah, but I'm always sleepy and I, I, I'd rather... Well, you know, I love sleep, though, but... <laughs> let's see, let's see. Take your pup to a... on a walk, you will BRB. Oh, that's... what... yeah, I, I'm... I'm gonna ask when you get back, then. If you come back. But I, I wanna... I wanna hear what dog you have. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for the lurk, though. And I hope you have a good walk. I love that pop time shows up anytime people say pop or dog or something like that. Wait, does it happen if you say cat? Hold on. You also noticed last time pop mo uh, pop pop moat. By the way, pop time also got pizza emotes. Hmm. I see. I see. Because sometimes it shows up with cats too. Maybe it has like a cooldown as well. You joined Discord, you'll post him there. Oh, thank you so much. But welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> Not finished, <laughs> Chris. <laughs> Says Chris, who's finished it like 53 times. <laughs> let's see, let's see. What what was it that I was gonna. Yeah, um, scissor attacks. I can deal with being slowed down. <gasps> Bonnie coming in clutch. You love to see it. Wait, what side did I come from? Yeah, this was the door. Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. We have never been here before. Krauses has been time now for a thousand buttons, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 1,000 buttons, yeah. Oh shit, two rows of tears. But only one crest. So we have to decide which way to go, huh? Why don't we... 
I want this. Uh, I vote this way. Why this way? Manly man's intuition. There's no such thing. Don't trust the manly man's intuition. So <laughs> kidding. Ah, that's stupid. You're stupid. Don't call him stupid. I won't vote this way. Okay, well, you're saying that way, so then I definitely want, don't want to go that way. <laughs> Why this way? Smart kid's intuition. And also, it's the way Zod didn't choose, so... Yeah, that's why I want to choose the other way, because you chose that way. <laughs> I'm with the kid. It's been a while since we teamed up, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah. We're, um... Opposite sides of the age spectrum allies. It was opposite sides of the age spectrum al alliance, but I understand there's big words in there. Opposite sides of the age spec spectrum alliance. Spectrum. Oh, um, Mira, Mirabelle, my friend, my sister from another mother. Please, no bells with us. Um, um, I, I'm with Isabel. Okay, I, I made my decision as well. Yes, Bell and Bow, Beauty Alliance. Beauty Alliance? Huh, what kind of name is that? Do you guys spend the day looking pretty? How dare you? Also, yes, just look at us. Isabeau strikes a pose, and Mirabelle follows suit a beat later. They both look striking. Ew. They have all chosen a side. So that only leaves... Oh no. Sifrin. You're the tiebreaker. But you hate being the tiebreaker. Can't we just get along? No. They insulted the beauty alliance. All that's left is war. Whoa. Unless you bring peace to the alliances by choosing a side. You're the only one that can bring peace to this land. <laughs> oh no, I have to choose. Well, I mean, it's pretty easy for me. I think I think you're supposed to choose them at the bottom because those are the two romance options and they chose the same side. So I feel like you're kind of supposed to choose that side anyway. I mean, I wanted to anyway, but don't trust the manly man's intuition. <laughs> four, four, four. Men do not have intuition. <laughs> That's a typo. Can you spotify? I can. I can. Also, we're getting an ad soon, so I can do that during the ad break. I mean, you know, I'm going to start the ad now, and then we're going to choose the side after that. I'm just going to start the ad now. You won't miss anything in the game. I won't make the decision until after the ad is over. So let's start it now. Yeah, I can do that now. Anyway. Um... Let us see. Cloudbot. Um, quotes. There are five pages. Okay. It has been edited. 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 There we go. It should be good now. Mm. Okay. Um. While you're separating, you would probably lay down and cry in this kind of situation. <laughs> because we only have one crest to open up a path uh, with, the, uh, with the tears. And there are two different ways to choose from. And then they split up to choose different ways to go. Um, it, 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 yeah. <laughs> and it's 444. It's an angel number. Didn't you get the second one right there? Yeah, but we used the first one. Um, It's the second one we found, but we used up the first one. So you, you can only use it once. You can't use it again. So... I... 
I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna choose the beauty alliance though. After the ad. Beauty Alliance, exactly, exactly. I think it's, they, they kind of want you to choose that because you can choose between Mirabelle and Isabel as a romance option, I think. So it just makes sense when they're both on the same side, you know? <laughs> the Booty Alliance. Yeah, the booty aligns. I mean, isn't that us, though? Isn't that us? We're back from the ads. Then, uh, beauty aligns. Yeah. Yes! We will not forget such a terrible slight, Sifrin. <laughs> we will not forget. We will not forgive. May you eat only potatoes for the rest of your life. I mean, that's not the worst you could have for the rest of your life. You can do a lot of things with potatoes, you know? Um, may your house fall down on your horrified face. Yeah, what she said. You're kidding, Sifrin. Don't look so distraught. I'm not kidding. I'll put potatoes in Sifrin's pockets. I mean, isn't that a good thing? Shh, don't tell them. I'll help you later. You assume a guarding stance. Bonnie immediately assumes an attacking stance. Alright, kids. Let's use this crest then, shall we? Let's go! Well, I'm not ready to go there just yet. I want to go this way first. The door's locked tight. It's locked by one of those weird word locks. Leave the door alone. We can we can wait. Uh did but Scott uh, but but Scott but Scott get deleted? Uh, I don't know how to explain it. Um but it was something about the creator of but Scott who can't keep up with because you know Twitch has been kind of um getting stricter with their bots and stuff on on the site so they needed to to make some changes to the bot for it to kind of bypass that stuff and i don't think they had the skills or resources or something to do it Have you played Earthbound? I have not. I have not. I've seen you play it, though. <laughs> mm. Bonnie will give you burnt cookies next time. Oh, never mind. Potatoes it is. <laughs> if it was, like, not working currently. Hmm. Butt spot changed and now it hates us. And it's our fault and we should feel bad. Yeah. I have to go check something. Do it. Do it. Uh, I'll give your turn to Sifrin. Mirabelle is now level 47 and learned the craft skill Lovely Moving Cure. Oh, is that another healing spell? Mirabelle just learned a new skill. Oh, thank change. I'll be able to help out more. You got the memory of Lovely Moving Cure. You'll always remember this. When equipped, your housemaiden will be able to use the lovely moving cure as a skill, even if she isn't at level 47. Lovely moving, cu moving cure is a skill that cures frozen for one ally. 
Oh. It's very useful that she knows this. I see, I see. Someone frozen in time. Oh, him. Oh? Oh? Please tell us more. N no, that's, uh, sorry. I mean, this man is another housemate and he's a scholar. He's working really hard on a project. It... Boring. Why don't you like him? Was he mean to you? Should we... I think it's more that she liked him, you know? Should we do something to him? Please don't. He is, um... He is... A human man. That exists. <laughs> That's what I told you. She, she likes him. <laughs> it's a human man that exists. <laughs> Okay, listen. I think he stole one of my priceless issues of the Cursing of Chateau Castle. Oh no. A thief. No, no, no. Forget I said that. I have no. But my issue disappears shortly after. A thief. Wait. Wait. Why, why is it skipping? The title reads The Cursing of Chateau Castle, issue 3. I did not move through the dialogue that fast. The game did that itself. You wave it around. Well, what do we have here? So I was right. This. This. Horrible thief. Okay, so she didn't like him after all. <laughs> Mirabel got back her priceless copy of The Cursing of Chateau Castle. She angrily stuffs it in her pocket. Victory. It's back. It is. Sorry for badmouthing him while he's frozen in time. He's a very talented scholar also. This was fun, Mirabel. You should show your ruthless side more often. N no. Why not? Marty, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. A book about traps and how they work. Some of the pages are bookmarked. Does it say anything about the traps you've seen so far? Traps, traps. Ah, one of the bookmarks is labeled Death Corridor. Yeah, that's the first time we died. <laughs> this is where you first died. Yeah, I, I told you. <laughs> You're still not sure why the trap activated when it did. You read the page. The type of trap in the Death Corridor is apparently called... If you feel safe, it activates a trap. If you feel safe, it, ac it activates a trap. <laughs> Oh, Sif, that's one uh, a hell of a disguised face you're pulling. Uh, disgusted, by the way. Not not disguised. Disgu uh, dis disgusted. <laughs> that's one hell of a disgusted face you're pulling. Well, can you blame me? It's a barrel. It's full of nothing. There's something on the counter. You found the scissors key. The keychain dangling from it is shaped like a hand in the scissors position. You put the key in your pocket. You now know where the scissors key is located. So, rock, paper, scissors. Just good old basic rock, paper, paper scissors. Makes sense. You will nod. It makes sense. It does. A chair. There's only one, so it'd be rude to sit down. I know. Some carving wood. It's like someone liked to carve during their break. I wonder where your own carving tools went. I brought my own paring knife. <laughs> that, that was the first thing that popped into my head, even though it wasn't the same at all. You're at work, but there's an issue in your code and it's driving you crazy? Oh no. Wait, what do you do for work, Marty? I don't know if I've ever asked. It's so warm in there. I feel that. You need a break to clear your mind? Well, you're welcome to hang out here to take a break. Your hair is giving you, like, sensory bad feelings. It said avocado toilet. <laughs> Some notes on safety. Beware of rock. Simple to the point. A change ornament. Yeah. Some very big rocks. Two of them seem to be missing. Could they be for various traps in the house? Okay, so that means that there are only two traps with a rock, and we have encountered both of them. 
Ah, get away from me. The door is locked tight. It's locked by one of those weird word locks. Say... Change. You say the word change aloud, nothing happens. Worth a try. Okay, let's try... S -s -s storage room. Room, 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 room. Remoom? I, I said it wrong the entire time. St storage remoom. Oh damn. I need another another word. I can only use it one one at, look at it curiously. You look at it. Isabel sees you look. Have you never seen a lock like this before, Sif? It's a special kind of Bogardian lock. Instead of a key, you need specific words to open. Words? Yes, you just need to say the words al aloud. I think they call it um an open phrase an open phrase fascinating so what is the phrase for this lock i do not know ah so it's locked yes yahoo good for us uh you're a physics researcher and doing some data analysis right now so lots of coding but it's so frustrating sometimes physics researcher that's cool Go take the hair and thus your sensory issues. <laughs> Chris. You just have not the... Uh, you just don't have the capacity to have them taken away. June could drive them away or like shorten them... Wait, dr drive... Drive the hair away. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I guess, I guess it's it's very possible to just get rid of it somehow. But you know, donate donate the hair to the the needy if you if you don't want it. All right, no. <laughs> you reach towards the the light. Everyone was healed. Your allies' craft skills and experience has been recorded for this location. See, we probably yes. You close your eyes. The gate is locked. You have the key, but you just notice there's a note stuck to the gate. The key is located in the trap building room. The king is leaving notes now? He must be forgetful. What an idiot. Hey, it happens. We have our own little forgetful one with us, don't we? Everyone looks at you. You pout. It's okay, Sifrin. We'll remember things for you. Okay, that's the only difference that Sifrin and I don't have in common. <laughs> I have good memory, he has bad memory. <laughs> we already cut the around your ears a couple of times because it's been so bad, but it you would like <laughs> You'll find the problem eventually, just hope it won't be another four hours and a stupid coma or something like that. Oh no. Hopefully you will figure it out sooner rather than later, Marty. And finish you say Oh, I see, I see, I see. It's not like cutting exactly, but maybe that is the correct word. It is, it, yeah, it is cutting. You could all be a programmer, spending hours looking at code to find small error in the syntax would make you want to turn inside out. <laughs> <laughs> Kinda wish you knew how to code or had the capacity to learn. Mm. It's okay, Sifrin. We'll remember things for you. You have many other talents, I'm sure. Not sure it helps, Mira. Why didn't we check the gate, though? Maybe we could have found the key faster. What's done is done. What's done is done. Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. It probably tells me that I can't go back, yeah. But what about the door with the key, the, 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 the open face? Strong sadness is again. Eh, we'll be fine. Let's go, go, go. Cutting with the machine, also cutting with scissors. Yeah, I, th 
think so? <laughs> they help you to remember, but they will not remember if you do it again. Hmm. Two sadnesses. Get ready, everyone. Damn. Okay, so... Wait. Stop it. I didn't mean to double-click there. This one... is weak to that. So you're gonna boost defense because it seems like we're gonna need it. Uh, you're gonna use scissor as well because I want us to get a jackpot attack. Oh. Oh, she was frozen. I've never seen that happen before. I want to see if that helps. The short-haired one is doing something. Okay, so getting a jackpot attack also um, brings you out of being frozen. Oh! Oh, crab. He killed the other one? And healed itself in the process. You know, actually, that's pretty nice. Because then I made the right approach by just attacking one at a time. <laughs> You did learn some coding stuff when in school, but you don't think you remember anything? Hmm. Knife to meet you. <laughs> she missed. Um... Let's do that. Hmm. Nice. That knife pun was incredibly edgy. <laughs> Damn right. Buy one, get one three. And two cleaver by half. <laughs> two cleaver by half. See, this, this, is, this, is a, this is a punny game. Getting another jackpot attack. Bye bye you breathe in and out. 7,000 experience. Sifrin is now level 49. Isabeau is now level 48. 48. <gasps> we won! Alright. One last floor to go. Wait, one last floor to go? Really? Are we that close? Um... That makes me nervous. This room feels safe too, doesn't it? Break time? Maybe not. We might still have to have a lot to do. To have a lot to 
What was that? It was my tummy, sorry. That was so loud. How hungry are you for it to be this loud? I don't get this swole by skipping meals. <sighs> anyway, let's take a break for now. <laughs> bon Bon, how much longer until the snacks are done? Five minutes. Okay, take your time. <laughs> hey, everyone. Hey, hey. Hmm? So, um, we haven't brought it up yet. So, um, I have a question. A uh, secret adult conversation for adults, no kids allowed? Do you not want Boniface to hear? Yeah. If we're sure they don't hear, then yeah. Say at a normal volume. Bonnie forgot to tie their shoe. <laughs> Give a thumbs up. Oh, gems, they actually did forget. Someone better tell them later. Good. Um, okay, so. If any of you bites the dust, what should we do with your body? Um, uh, what? Yikes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask. I know it's not the best moment, but most of us have different beliefs, don't we? So, uh, well, in case change forbid one of us dies today and the others are able to honor your body, how should we do it? Like, Madame Odile, is there a Kabuan way, or...? No, it's... it's a valid concern. Well, in Kabu, you'd burn the body and take the ashes to a gem maker to transform them into a diamond. But that will be easily feasible, will it? You change into a diamond? Hardcore. Well, technically the core wouldn't be the hard part of that, would it? <laughs> Um, ChatGPT has been a game changer though. It's much faster to code stuff, even if you have to adjust. But once the code runs without any error, it's when the not so fun part starts checking if the stuff actually makes sense. Mm. You love puns? How can anyone hate them? I, I know. It doesn't make any sense. This is what we should be using AI for, not replacing artists. Agreed. Agreed. But yeah. Yeah. Chris is... Uh, we call Chris Dadman for a reason, because... Wait, was it you... Did Rods... Was Rods the first one to call you Dadman? Or was someone else first? Was it he who started using that word? Or name for you. Yeah, we, we, we call Chris Dadman. <laughs> because he is he is he is Dadman. <laughs> but if that's not doable, how can you can donate my body to any house in Vogard? If Vogard is saved, I'm sure they'd have a use for the body of a savior. Well, the House of Change recommends burying your body under a tree so our body can nurture the nature around it. Be part of change and all that. But it is the same. F uh, is it the same? Is it the same for you, Isabel? I mean, I'd be dead, right? So I don't really care that much about later. This is that. That's my approach to it as well. <laughs> and for well, Bonnie, what should um, we won't allow uh, Bonnie to die. Over our dead bodies. And if we're about to die. There are ways to use craft to make sure Bonnie will survive. So, no matter what. You all nod. And that's something you all agree with. What about you, Sifrin? Will there even be a time this will apply to you? You won't die for good, so it doesn't matter. But... Throw my ashes to the sky? <laughs> Bring me on the highest peak? It won't happen, it doesn't matter. I mean, I kind of want to just say this, it won't happen, it doesn't matter, just to see how they react to it. Because they don't know that I'm in a, in a time loop. I 
And technically not, but he made it canon. Honestly, no idea where it all came from, but you enjoy it. <laughs> That's fair. Wait, it won't happen, it doesn't matter. How delightfully naive. I suppose you won't mind if I throw your ashes to the nearest latrines then. Uh-huh. I get it, because I'm full of <laughs> Hey, are you done talking? Because it's snacks time, baby. Oh, it's a serious business snack time. I'm listening. Snack times are always serious business, dummy. Today I have um some Madeleines. Madeleines. Thank you for making some Boniface. Um, um I also have some pineapple slices. I have some sugar on them. Just plain pineapple slices? With sugar. And pineapple's good, you know? It is. It's just not very exciting, is all. Exciting? You want exciting? Then eat this! Fish head! Oh no. Fish head? Fish head? Why a fish head? Fish heads are yummy and the textures are different and good. Are they? They are. Okay. So which snack do you guys want? Like, I don't eat- what, what are madelines? Are they like some type of pastry? Hold on, I wanna see. It is a type of pastry. And they look like, uh, clamshells. I mean... You have seen those. I'll pick those, then. It's more like a mini cake. I'll pick that. There you go. Bonnie hands you some Madeleines. Ma Madeleines. You bite into one. Soft. Delicious. After eating your snacks, everyone's health has been restored. What is with this ominous music? Bonnie seems to be thinking hard about something. We'll save your sister, Bonnie. Huh? Oh. Yeah, I know. Hmm. Rare Isabeau loss? Wait, what do you mean? Isabeau didn't seem like- It wasn't Isabeau who wanted, uh, the fish head. <laughs> uh, it's soft like a yogurt cake, but more eggy in taste. It's delicious. Oh, I see, I see. It's super hard to make, though. Hmm. Oh, it was about- oh, it was about pineapple not being exciting. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Mirabelle is biting her nails. You point to them. Nails. Oh. Mm. Thanks, Sifrin. She should wear gloves like you do. We're gonna be okay. I hope so. You might even say... Huh? Oh, no. We're gonna nail it. You know it. <laughs> I won't let you win. Eh, you almost did, though. She, she was close to laughing. I know it. We could die today, huh? Oh, well. I've had a good life. You won't die today, Odile. Oh, is that so? I won't let you. You can prevent it, after all. Hmm. Keep that sort of speech for the younger ones. I'm sure Isabel would love it. Yeah, because he's the best. Go away now. I need my alone time. You leave Odile alone. Okay, let's see what she is. I'm so mad. Your pun was too easy. It was bad. You laugh. She wouldn't be this mad if it didn't get to her. That's true. Okay. <laughs> How can anyone be mad at a pun? 
Damn. Hey, Sif. You know you look like a hamster when you eat? Uh, you, you know you look like a hamster when you eat? You do? No, I don't. I'm so sorry to be the one to tell you this, but you do. Your cheeks get all big and round. Oh, it is me. It is me. <laughs> If it is me. I also I also look like a hamster when I eat, I suppose. I also get big cheeks. Do you enjoy that almost every other language decided on on us and English said, no nah, bro, it's pineapple in it? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. It is really weird. And it's like pine apple. Pine? Apple? Why is that the word? It's like, it has nothing to do with pines. And it has nothing to do with apples. I mean, apple is also a fruit. That's like the only thing they have in common, really. The tiny man needs to go to sleep. Will not eat a <laughs> pineapple. <laughs> Your cheeks get all big and round, like a cute hamster. Isabel. Yeah? Stop being cheeky. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why- this is why- <laughs> This is why they are the best match. <laughs> <laughs> Isabel eats a whole cookie at once and makes a hamster face. You stick your tongue out. If you eat pineapple, it also eats you. Mm. <laughs> it's it's true. You reach towards the light. Everyone was healed. Your allies, craft skills, and experience has been recorded for this location. Save your progress. Yes. You close your eyes. I played for 11 hours and 28 minutes. If you come back here in a loop, you get these stats. Yeah, yeah. And you also don't have to look for all the keys and everything. Oh! Oh! <laughs> they grow the five bits. Are you ready? Ready. It's like ah. Uh, oh damn! It's spoopy. Wait. Do you hear that? It's sound. That's that's the king. He's crying. Crying. There's a key on the floor. I pick it up. We found the empty key. The key chain dangling from it is shaped like a mask of some kind. We put the empty key in your pocket. Well, judging by its location, I'm guessing this is the key for the gate just ahead, but... The gate is covered in some sort of... Hair? Thread? It doesn't seem locked, but... You're not sure the key you picked up would be useful here. This thread is so strange. You can't seem to move it aside. A frozen thread? It seems to be covering the rest of the floor, too. Can we cut it? Whoa! Bonnie flipped your cape up, grabbing your dagger. Aya! <laughs> no, you ruined my dagger! Did you break my dagger, darling Bonnie? No. No. I promise. Oh, it actually isn't. That's good news. So scary, Sif. This dagger isn't broken, but it didn't seem to have done anything to the thread. Oh, wait. Look. It did something. The thread is slightly dented here. So a sharper knife could do the trick, maybe. I suppose. 
Either way, we should explore this floor more. Before you start walking, Bonnie tugs on your cloak. Sorry, friend. Wow, they must really feel bad. An apology? From you, Bonnie? That's... Magnificent. <laughs> Magnificent. Oh, no. <sighs> that was actually kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> um, burn the earth tree cardinal sin one yeah <laughs> spoilers <laughs> 420 nice orion magnificent <laughs> i mean not funny sifrin <laughs> you crab <laughs> a knife huh? Damn, what is up with all this hair? <gasps> the door is locked. The symbol over the keyhole is shaped like an angry mask. Okay, so it's not the key, the the the, the keyhole we have. No, the keyhole. Oh, the keyhole, by the way, the key. Little paintings of people looking at the artist. They look very realistic. A mirror. You and your allies are reflected in it. That's a big mirror. Massive, even. And there's not really anything else of interest in this room. I don't know anything about it. Before the house shifted around because of the king, it was in a part of the house I didn't often walk by. Hmm. Isabel seems to be looking for something. If it is what I think it is, then it should be... Aha! Uh -huh. Everyone say fromage. Fromage. Uh what was that? Oh, look. Something's on the ground. A piece of paper? <laughs> Behold. <gasps> oh! <laughs> it's a picture of all of you. Wait, is it is it a mirror that takes pictures? Magnificent is absolutely beautiful. Mm. <laughs> Mokte every week. <laughs> Good. It's us. This is lovely, isn't it? It's a crafted mirror that takes pictures. I heard rumors someone was creating one, but I didn't know this someone lived in Dormon's house. It looks so surprised. Eh, only Isabeau knew this was coming. Pictures are so rare. It's nice to have one of us. Thank you for telling us about it. And we're taking a picture, Isabel. Oh! Eh. It's nothing. Well, they could have taken another one. Got a memory of reflection. We'll always remember this. When memory of reflection is equipped, your defense will be automatically boosted at the start of a battle. What should we do with it? Hmm. Odile looks at you. Will you keep it safe? Oh, one with all the secret pockets? You beam. You got the mirror picture. You put the picture in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Yay! I want to see, because that seems like a good one. Um... Okay, maybe it's for Isabeau, then. Automatically defends up at the start of battle. What was the so weak again? What did that do? Oh yeah, I think I know. Now we're gonna we're gonna switch to the one that he has now. <gasps> oh, a flash of the mirror somehow made something appear. You reach down and pick it up. You found the smiling key. The keychain dangling from it is shaped like a smiling mask. You put the smiling key in your pocket. You now know where the smiling key is located. 
Tell me you can keep that. Yeah, we could. So keys are saved if you loop further, but you have to get them if you need to pro uh, to progress. Um. Yeah, I mean you, you the um, the keys are saved if you end up looping back to this area. So you don't have to pick it up again, I think. Hey, elusive wolf, how you doing? Can't stay, but thought you would drop a follow. Uh, drop a fellow owl member alert. <gasps> Thank you so much. I appreciate that. I didn't know that you also were an, an owl scout. Thank you. And also, thank you so much for the lurk. Hold on. Let me... Let me... We can't progress there right now. Ah, fuck. Okay. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, this is on my hands. Holy crap. Look at the health bar. It takes up the entire screen. Well, they're... Hands. So they should be... You can see the, the, the face of it. Boost all allies' defense for three turns. Yes, let's do that. That seems like a good idea. Powers up the enemy? No, you turn... Okay, well, that's good, though, because um, now we're gonna get a... Cures frozen for one ally, three turns. Okay, but I'm not gonna do that, because once we get a jackpot attack, it actually removes the frozen condition anyway. Which is good. That did, uh, that did a lot. No, I, d uh, I didn't mean to use guard. I accidentally did that. I didn't mean to. <laughs> How can you miss? It's so big. <laughs> um... Okay, you're gonna heal. Odile. Heal Odile. Lowers one enemy's attack for three turns. Oh, I thought that I lost this when he equipped uh, the new one. you're just gonna guard, I think. Curves into a ball? What does that mean? Knife to meet you. Okay, now we're getting another uh, jackpot attack, and I think that should be enough to kill it. Yes. A thousand experience. These chip tunes go hard. Mm. 
It is a. It, it does have some really good music. <gasps> We're getting another picture here. It's you and your allies. Wait. The photos. Photos. So what is the point of this room if we can't do it again? That sure is a pillar. It's a pillar. It's a pillar. That sure is a broken pillar. It's true. Damn. Well, okay, that's... We can't progress any farther there, then. Nope, go away. Wait. I guess I didn't try to go this way, did I? Ah, fuck. What is this? Misère. Let us... Uh, is this also... Paper? I think it is paper. Yeah. Are they all just weak to paper? Well, this one is weak in general, so that's good. God damn it. Sifrin is now level 50. Damn. <gasps> a dog. Dog. Doggy. Puppy. And an actual human also standing right there. They have a massive bow too. Looks cute. Massive bow. Massive bow. Oh. Oh, that's my friend. He gave him that bow. And that's their dog. <gasps> oh, oops. You can never tell them you noticed their dog before them. <laughs> no, never, ever, ever. They'd make fun of me for days. At least they'd think it's funny, it seems. If you did that to me, Mirabelle, my revenge would be swift and absolute. I would never, Madame Deal. Never, ever. This was one of. Th this was a one-time mistake. I'm glad they're with their dog, at least. They're not alone. A dog and its owner. Some old boring books. Oh, there's a Kabuan book here. Ah, that's a craftonomy book. We don't really have time to read about craft of any kind. Keep going. You leave the book alone. Okay, fine. A broken figurine of the change god. Closet contains some bandages, painkillers, and <gasps> eye patches. These look ugly. Friends is better. Eh. Does your eye patch fit still, Sif? I can adjust it if you ever need me to. You smile. Isabel made your eye patch when you lost your eye. He apparently crafted so it wouldn't bother you or itch or anything. It's comfy and fits you well. Aw. Small paintings of various housemaidens. You can see Mirabelle in some of them. A cooking book all about... Croissant. So Mirabelle, about Volgarding croissants. You tune out. You don't want to even think about croissants. Odile is smiling, which means they're probably done. Hmm. Fascinating. Thank you, Mirabelle. Eh. Eh. You were right, Mira. You have something to say, perhaps? Oh no, we would never. Uh, it's just, it's very cute, right? Yes, it's cute. Your eyes light up and everything when you're learning things. It's cute. Cute? Deal isn't cute, she's old. No, Boniface, they have a point. I am very cute, aren't I? I wonder how cute you'll think I am when I put wasabi in your sandwiches when you least expect it. You'd help me out, wouldn't you, Boniface? 
I'm always up for putting spicy stuff into people's lunches, so yeah. Oh no. Sorry, madame. We didn't say anything. You chuckle. Ah, it looks like Sifrin wants a sandwich as well. Wouldn't you like me to offer you one of my sandwiches, Sifrin? You've been spotted. Um... That would be so cute of you, do you? <laughs> I would say, I'm gonna say that. <laughs> uh, that would be so cute of you, do you? <laughs> I'll put twice as many peppers in there as deal. See that you do. Scary. <gasps> Something about spicy food? I got an achievement for that? You got a memory of first strike. You'll always remember this. When equipped, memory of first strike makes everyone faster at the start of a battle. Damn. It's a barrel. It's full of various nuts. There's a chain on the table, probably for a pendant. Pick it up. You got the massive chain. You put the massive chain in your pocket along with your souvenirs. It's comfortable and easy to wear. Yeah, yeah. Chivo, you get a chivo. You got pepper juice. You give it to Bonnie for safekeeping. Various supplies. Okay, so it seems we got everything in this room. I haven't gotten many achievements in this game. I think I've gotten like two. And this is the third one that I've gotten. Nope. Oh shit. I can't pass anywhere. An oven for clay. It has a name, but you can't remember right now. A kiln? Is that what you mean? A kiln? It's a kiln. <gasps> I got it! I'm I'm the best. No. <laughs> it's a kiln, Sifrin. Oh. Some weird tools to make pots. I forget what they're called. Pottery wheel, Sif. Ah. Pottery wheels. Pottery wheels. Someone frozen in time. Oh, that's a pottery teacher. She doesn't like me. I broke the whole class wor uh, class's work during the last ch uh, class I had with her. How did that happen? Everyone's finished work goes on the shelf over there. Or here. And uh, I um, bumped into it. A simple mistake. And it was fine. But then I tried to jump away so I wouldn't break anything, but... I bumped into someone else. Uh-oh. Who bumped into someone else? Who bumped into someone else? And so on. Until someone bumped into the table, flipping it over. Right into the shelf. Wish I could have seen it. Yes, this sounds quite entertaining. <laughs> so many people- How many people died? <laughs> how many people died? Holy crap. An open book stained by clay and dirty hands. It's an issue of the Cursing of Chateau Castle issue 87. That's the highest number we've seen so far. The highest one before this was 51. Issue 87? You should remember this number. A broken figurine of the change god. There's some unused clay here. <gasps> you got some lumpy clay. You put the clay in your pocket along with your souvenirs. A broken figurine of the da da da. Stool. But there's only one, so you'd be rude to sit down. A shelf filled with little change gods. They're all different shapes and sizes. Some smiling, some crying, some with no face at all. There's a box here. The box is filled with crafting materials and finished art pieces that no one liked. Including... Papier... Oh, paper mash. Paper mash gloves. They're massive. They were not made for a kid, that's for sure. Hmm. You take the gloves and put them near Isabeau's hands. Oh my. A perfect fit. Isabel bats his eyes. <laughs> my dear Sifrin. Would you do me the honor? You laugh and try to put the gloves on him. <laughs> the stiff paper mash makes it hard, but after some effort, you succeed in your task. Foo -foo -foo. I... I... <laughs> I've heard that before. 
orb. I just don't understand. I'm, where, where does this come from? Where does this come from? Paper mash hands. How comfortable are they? Not even a little bit. You got the paper mash hands. Paper mash hands are equipped to Isabeau. That's just how it is now. The paper mash hands are very special. When equipped, they turn Isabeau's basic attacks from rock to paper. Oh. That's actually very useful. Because he only does uh, rock attacks. I just want to see. Hmm. The closet contains some tools to make pottery. There's also got two salty broths. Give them to Molly. Wait, what does the salty broth actually do? Uh, drink that lowers all of an ally's craft skill. Cooldowns by six. So salty. Oh, okay. I guess that's very useful. It's a barrel. They, they do love their nuts here. You can't even imagine a number higher than 87. <laughs> Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. I didn't even know what the keyhole was for. Or like what it... Go away. <gasps> oh! That's... That's... That's my room. Oh, damn. A bed. Is that your bed? Yes. Um... We gave it away. It smells fruity, just like your name. <laughs> Mirabelle plums. <laughs> My roommate gifted me some Mirabelle plums scented soap a while back. She may never clean her room and she may uh, she may keep me from sleeping by, by muttering formulas to herself in the middle of the night. But she does give great gifts. Yeah, she is. <laughs> Fruity. Uh, what's your favorite number? Who are you asking? Some flowers. I'm trying to grow them out. They haven't died yet. Even though I haven't been here for months now. I suppose that's something I can thank the king for. <laughs> Mirabel's hairdresser. Don't even think about it, Sifrin. It'll be rude to look inside, so you don't. Horror books. There's The Cursing of Chateau Castle, issue 68. Death Die Dice Maker. Death Die Dice Maker. 100 ways to die horribly. The meat slicing. Ah, that last one is actually a cooking book. Issue 68, you should remember this number. A lot of horror books in there. Is this one about a group of young adults being forced to kill each other for someone's uh, entertainment? It is. Hmm. We should have a book club sometimes, just the two of us. We should. We could exchange letters and recommendations after we beat the king. What? Just you two? The rest of us aren't invited? No. Girls only. Yeah, back off, Isabeau. <sighs> Being told to back off by Mirabelle herself. I feel blessed somehow. Everyone? Fruity four. <laughs> Fruity four. <laughs> My favorite number is five. I like three, five... Um, seven, twenty-three, twenty-seven. All odd numbers. Any number with like three, five, or seven, uh, I I I like. <laughs> but five is like my main favorite number. You think you like nine? I also like nine. You also used to like 88 because he was eight two times. We don't really like it anymore. Hmm. The closet has a lot of different dresses that look similar to Mirabelle's. Mm -hmm. 
Is it her closet? I mean, I would assume so. Rolled papers. It's a barrel. It's full of nothing. Papers filled with complicated equations. This way must lead to sh a shared bathroom. A bed. It's my roommate's bed. Do you think she's okay? What is she like, this roommate of yours? She's the worst. I really don't like her. Oh? I didn't know Belle could hate people. She doesn't clean her side of the, uh, her room ever. She leaves her experience and weird potions around everywhere. She always sings way too loud. When I ask her to maybe change songs and sing something I might like, she always tells me no can do, princess. She's mean and has no respect towards others. So, a normal roommate. Maybe. But, even so. Not seeing her around, it really worries me. Positive. Gotta stay positive. We're getting an ad starting now. Um... It's got a little tail, just like, uh, just a little guy. <laughs> oh, you don't like it? Do you hate it? <laughs> Chris. <laughs> but she said she left potions around, so... I assume that there is some potions we can pick up. So one of them is broken, but the others seem intact. Let's see. You got one pepper juice. You got one thyme juice. Ginger juice. Can I not get one that will, like... Like, basic heal potion? A closet filled with unsafe-looking potions. You don't... The pun is funny, but you just learned some people use it as, like, dog whistle thing? Wait, what? What do you mean, people use what as a dog whistle thing? The number eight? <laughs> uh, it is still some of you used to names because... It it's not easy to change them, but some you have changed. The number 80. Wait, but what does that even mean? How how do you use a number for dog whistles? Well, I, I don't even understand what you mean by that. <laughs> also, 88 has some less than great connotations that you won't get into. Hmm. I think I have heard it, but I don't know. You don't know how TOS friendly it is, but like it's the eighth letter. Well, I know what letter you're talking about, but it doesn't really... ...tell me much. But uh, that's fine. That is fine. Um... Wait, maybe it's you who told me before, Ryan. I feel like we've had this conversation before, because it's, it's kind of giving me some sort of deja vu. You don't think you have? Well, someone has. Someone has, I think. Hmm.
It's a mystery. Mm. Honestly, I'm surprised that I haven't died yet today. Except that one time on the banana peel. But that was like... <laughs> that was just me being stupid. Hmm. Was your roommate making bombs? Because with all the materials she has in here, it looks like she was learning how to make craft bombs. What? No. Was she? Uh -huh. I'm just saying. She has the materials to make a craft bomb. Looks like she didn't finish it though. If that makes you feel better. How do you know how to make a craft bomb? I, I learned it while I was studying to become a defender. But isn't that just common knowledge? I've never learned that. And you're the book smart one. No. <laughs> I've never learned how to make a bomb. I know I'm a kid and you'd think I definitely know how to make bomb. <laughs> Wait. I know I'm a kid and you'd think I definitely know how to make bombs. Yeah, sure. Every kid knows. Why wouldn't they? But I've never learned either. Uh, oh. What else does it need then? Um, why? Zon. We have to throw a bomb at the king. It'll be so funny. What? Yes. It would be funny. It would. What else do we need? Your roommate has some stuff already, so we just need... Isabel, start explaining what you need with every confusing words. What? Use simple words, Zah. Hmm. There's already a short gizmo gadget here, so we just need a long thingy thing and a secret ingredients. <gasps> We have a thingy thing! We do have the thingy thing! Oh, okay. Makes sense. It doesn't. Time to find those things. Got the short gizmo gadget. You put the short gizmo ga gadget in your pocket along with your souvenirs. Hmm. Okay, I guess we're done with this room. Um, haven't died. Well, I have, but it was a stupid way to die. I rolled. Yeah, that is... Someone frozen in time. Oh, that's... I don't know who that is, actually. They have a cool necklace, though. Let me see. Oh, I know them. That's another housemaiden. I haven't, hadn't seen them in a while. I didn't know they were changing. Come to think of it, I hadn't seen them for a little bit before the king. Maybe they were close to done crafting... Maybe they were close to done crafting their body. If we can beat the king, you can see them and meet them again. Yes! <laughs> Souvenir is a good word. Rolled is the Elden Ring tagline at this point. Well, yes... To be fair, though, I say that in every single game that you can roll, or I say I dashed in every game where you can dash as well. So it's like, I dashed, I rolled, I just... <laughs> every time. Retire it. <laughs> or ta Tajin, as Auto Cucumber wanted you to type. Menacing banana peel. Yeah, menacing um uh, menacing banana peel. That is the one. Also, thank you for that, Orion. An empty clean bed. There's something on it. It's an animal, but not real. It's made out of fabric and other things. It's usually for kids. Those things have a name. Plushies? It's a It's a stuffed animal, dummy. Oh. Guys, a friend forgot an easy word again. Dude, isn't that just everyone, though? I literally forget the word bicycle sometimes, but I... I... Again... Sifrin is very relatable. <laughs> Sifrin? Sif. We really have to do something about this, Sifrin. Did you really forget about a basic word like stuffed animal? Hey, some of the things you don't remember the words for aren't basic. I use my brain for other things. You tell them. Things other than remembering the word stuffed animal. What do you use the space in your brain for anyway? Puns? 
<laughs> well, well, I mean, what else would you need the space for? As a matter of fact, yes. Well, that's fine, but my brain is just stuffed with puns. Crap. <laughs> yes. I love this game. <laughs> uh, some frozen flowers. They smell like flowers. Yeah, yeah. Candles. Sniff, sniff. Pomegranate. Pomegranate. Do you mean you mean pomegranate? Pomegranate. 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 You did it. Everyone claps proudly. <laughs> some miles. Let's see. You got some pepper juice, thyme juice, and ginger juice. The bookcase is filled with books about body craft. Interesting. Can you tell me more about this? Oh, well, hey, hey, Dial. Don't you already know all this stuff? Hmm? What do you mean? Um, you're always asking questions about Volgard and change and stuff, but don't you already know about it? Huh. You never thought about it. Yeah, I was wondering about this too. You're always asking questions, which is fun. But I can't believe you'd go to another country and not learn all about it beforehand. If only because it'll make you look stupid. How insightful, you two. What? Do you already know about the things you ask about? Hmm. I do know some of the things I ask you about, but I also believe there's a difference between knowledge learned in books and knowledge learned by talking to people. No, that's very, very smart. Very true. That peel was plantain some thoughts into your head. <laughs> yes, that's true, Chris. You forget any word at any time, it's a skill. Yeah. It, it happens to me too. I think it happened a few streams ago as well, where I just couldn't remember any word, like any any basic word. It was kind of embarrassing, honestly. Siphon is all of us. Mm. Palm is in the game as well. It's true. It's true. Knowledge is important, but the meaning behind it, the emotional piece, that's important too. Books don't tell me anything about how it feels to be surrounded by Vogardian culture, to be bathed in it. it blah, blah, bathed the biddle. Bathed in it. <laughs> but the three of you do. And you clearly love your country. Love the change belief. And it's making me like it too, I suppose. Oh. Oh, Madame Odile. I don't get it. Huh. It's okay. You don't need to understand. I just want to know all I can about Vogardian culture, that's all. Hmm. Yeah, that's that's that pretty much sums up English. No, just... <laughs> Pictures of different people. Some of them are covered in bandages, but they're all smiling. Hmm. Wait, Sifrin? Are you curious about the change god statues, perhaps? Oh, um, no, not really. Huh, okay. Well, let me know if you ever want to know more about them, okay? Is it because you looked at the statue too, the statues too often? Oh, damn. A book detailing how to craft your body. Wow, this book looks simpler than the one I've studied. I've studied. Apparently they made some big strides in body craft recently. <clears throat> Before it took close to a year to make big changes. But now you can change in a month or so. It's interesting. Crafting your body so... Accepted here in Vogard. In Kabu, using craft on yourself would be grounds for prison. Prison? But why? Because if you can craft your body to your liking, where's the limit? Take the king, for example. Oh, it's like grafting? No, <laughs> Is the king kind of like Godric the Grafted? 
They say the crafted body to become. Uh, they say he crafted his body to become so massive, he can destroy houses in a single gesture. And that's without mentioning his mastery over time craft too. But that's. I'm not saying Kabu is correct. I'm just telling you their point is point of view. Plus, it's not like there aren't ways to do body crafting Kabu if you know where to look. Oh my, Madame Adil. Were you part of the uh, were you part of the underground resistance? I'll never tell. Resistance uh, resistance zoology. <laughs> resistance zoology. Uh, candles. Lavender. Paper and pen. Looks like someone was in the middle of writing down their change. You and Odile look closer. Ah. Hey, don't look. It's private. Just because everything's frozen doesn't mean we should look at everything, you know? Oh, I wasn't aware. My apologies. He's right. You look away. No, it's fine. It's fine. You didn't know. But still, this brings back memories. Ah, I would love to crab my body more. I would love to be two centimeters taller. <laughs> Why two centimeters? Aren't you tall enough already? I think you're too tall and you should cut it out. Cut what out? Anyway, Mira, you don't understand. With two, two more centimeters, I'll pass the threshold. With two more centimeters, I'll finally be tall with a capital T. Uh, I support you and your tall dreams. What a simple reason. Crafting your body, huh? And, you know, instead of crafting your body itself, maybe there are easier ways to gain height. Oh? Like what? You could wear high heels. High heels hurt my feeties. Drink lots of milk? Milk make me, makes me sick sometimes. We could tie your hands to a pillar and tug your feet really hard. It's worth a try. Anyone have a rope? I'm sorry I brought up t <laughs> I'm sorry I brought us to this point. Let's stay focused, please. Some vials, let's see. You got two salty broths. Give them to Bonnie. Okay. Wait, what is that? It's you. I want to see if it actually said the height here. Um <laughs> because it's like it seems so specific. <laughs> What what is what what is the height that makes you tall with a capital T if he's two centimeters away from it? I guess we'll never know. The closet is full with many different types of clothes. Oh look at this shirt. It has the same material as your cloak, right, Sid? This also looks incredibly warm. I still don't know how you managed to wear your cloak this whole summer. You've had this cloak for a while. I'm, I relate to that as well during summer. Like, any any time of the year. <laughs> I never really get hot with it, though. Really? Sif, can I look at your cloak for a sec? You nod. Taking care to not touch you, Isabeau kneels and takes a hold of your cloak. Ah. Your cloak's been soon with some kind of temperature regulation spell crafted into the stitching. That's kind of cool. No wonder you always look comfortable no matter the weather. Huh? What? Isn't that really, really advanced crafting? Oh, it's also been crafted to make the cloak grow, grow with you. It must have been incredibly expensive, unless it was handmade. Gobino Kitsune I'm Shield. All pointy X138. Ears, my love. <laughs> Gobi? Hello! Thank you for the 138 bits. That was a very random number, but I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> How you doing? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. How's the moving and everything going? Or, I mean, I know you've been moving and like you have moved, but how is the, the unpacking going, maybe? Wait, didn't you also have your wedding? Wait, no. Aren't you married now? It would be like some funny number. Mm, you want to know if it uh, if you're tall or tall? I'm short, but with a with a, not a capital S. 
It's 69 twice. Hmm. You're a married man now, so you have to donate 69 for the wife, not... So, 138? <laughs> really? That's <laughs> uh, so funny. <laughs> oh, 60, 69 twice. Yeah, that that's... I... I... I can't math, okay? <laughs> but thank you so much, Gobi. And congratulations on being married now. Wait, what What day was it that you got married? Because it was this month, but I don't remember the date. Gobi's married? Yes, he is. Saturday? <gasps> this Saturday? Sa satire day. Yeah, satire day. But congratulations. That is that is so cool. How I, I hope you had a good day. Is Saturday just gone. Mm. I hope I hope it was a good day. Hope it was a great day. Wait, did you guys did you guys go somewhere? Where are you gonna have your honeymoon? Because I imagine that you haven't gone there yet. It was great being nerds who streamed it on YouTube and you didn't tell me about it? Damn. No honeymoon just yet. Gotta get paperwork sorted. That's that's understandable. That is understandable. It must have been incredibly expensive unless it was handmade. How long you had this? You try to remember. Nothing comes to mind. You shrug. Um... I'm really jealous. Sorry. Wait. <laughs> right. <laughs> you started a hype train now. Damn. Wait. Da ding. Da, da ding. <laughs> uh, all right. Wait. Ryan, thank you for gifting three subs to con well one to congratulations W E <laughs> and the ding and Gobi. Thank you so much. Now you are sub Gobi. Uh, you sound surprised. I am capable of doing the right thing from time oh, to Gobi, time. Thank you for the sixty nine butts. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits. And Gobi, thank you for the 69 bits. <laughs> thank you so much, guys. You do kind. You too kind. What are you doing? What are you doing? Um Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. As partial vegan, it's going to need to be in a gave <laughs> That's Oh, uh, that's funny. Um, they're coming to stay in your bathtub for their honeymoon. They're gonna share with Rods. Damn, it's gonna be crowded in your bathtub. Um, a wedding. Oh, oh, not wedding. I see. I was like, I was just saying the ding. <laughs> wedding. Dude, I'm, I'm so slow. I'm so slow. I didn't catch on until just now. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> um, <laughs> she's in the chat and she said she's down for it. Damn, that's... <laughs> You're gonna have a good time in in, in uh, Chris's bathtub. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Orion. <laughs> a soul search? <laughs> Welcome in, welcome in. Um, okay, I'm gonna do the 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 camera while while the well, actually, I don't wait. Hold on. Um. <laughs> uh. 
Um, you still not switch over your bank bank cards on Twitch from the UK to to US? Mm. But how you doing, Palm? And Soul Search, welcome in. Does the bathtub have jets and bubble bath? Um. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, that is your wife. <gasps> welcome in, welcome in. I'm so sorry. I'm so slow. Dude, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so slow today. <laughs> that is your wife. Damn. Okay, well, now we now I know. Now I know. You're very welcome to join in and congratulations with your wedding as well. Both of you. Both of you. And two glasses of wine. <laughs> Back to lurking, wives in the chat. Yeah, I yeah, I it took me a while. It took me a while, but we I got there in the end. <laughs> so you're gonna go watch it on her laptop. Mm. Well, it's nice to see you both. It is very nice to see you both. Um, it does not, but you can put three scented candles and a bath bomb shaped like a toaster. <laughs> no, Chris. <laughs> You're Mr. Kitsune now? Mm. Mr., by the way. Mrs. I meant Mrs., not Mr. Damn. See, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I have no excuse for being this way. Um... Yeah, let me do the, the camera, uh, the face camera, while I catch up with the rest of the messages. Hold on. Let me do the, the timer. Is it two minutes? Wait, is it two minutes? I think it's two minutes. Yeah, I think I think it's two minutes. I forgot. Also, I haven't used this since I moved my, 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 my setup, so now it's really high up. I can't reach. So... <laughs> I can't reach. I, I need to fix that. I need to fix that. Um, <laughs> but also, thank you so much, Ryan, for gifting a sub to Mrs. Kitsune as well. Um, too kind. Thank you so much for the hype train. Thank you so much for the hype train. Why? Why does it say you collected all the level zero emotes? What is a level zero uh, hype train? Because isn't that every moment of every day when no other hype train is going? <laughs> You're all right. That's good. That is good, Palm. That is good. What's the origin of the brow cam? Lauren was asking the other day and you were like, <laughs> so it was because of Panda. Well, no, actually, you know, it's it has more of a story than that. Um, So the thing is, with the brow cam is that I shared I shared something that that I usually do on my birthday every year and that is like I I used to do like one of these to see like oh I still don't have any wrinkles on my forehead so like another year older still no wrinkles so then I just share that in in on stream when I had this this zoomed in camera and uh, it just became a thing when Jean showed up in chat, and Jean wanted to me to use the the camera to check. Oh, still no wrinkles. And then Panda wanted it to be <laughs> a point routine, <laughs> so that's pretty much it. <laughs> uh, that is that. Oh, that was the wrong camera. That is pretty much it. So that's the story of that. <laughs> what is the level zero hype train? Is that every moment every day? <laughs> oh, thank you for adding that code. That's us. A... <laughs> uh, you didn't get any emote alerts. Gonna dig for it yourself. Hmm. Yeah, that's weird. Unless you've gotten all of them already. Um. You'd have to be surprised to make the brows fit the cam. Mm. True. True. But thank you guys so much for the hype train, though. I appreciate it. You too, you too kind. You too kind, all of you. The best beans on Twitch. It's true. It is true. Um, I think you got this, buddy. Stir the pot. 
That, that's actually kind of funny. <laughs> I like that emote. <laughs> So it's essentially a wrinkle check? Yes, it is a wrinkle check. Good lore. Mm. <laughs> um, yeah, so it, that, that's the story behind that. Not too interesting, but there you go. Oh, I'm really jealous, sorry. Yeah, if you ever sold this, you'd be set for a few months, if, you, if not a whole year, you know? craftsmanship alone. Crafting stuff into the stitching is really interesting actually. Hmm. Huh. Spoken like a true clothing designer, huh? Uh, well. Did I tell you about that? Hmm. Oops. Quick, say something. Uh, just just because you, your clothes are so cool, huh? Oh, thanks. Oh yeah, because he shared that with us, that that was his dream. But we've died since then, so in this timeline, we haven't actually said that. Um... That sounds familiar, but you can't place the <laughs> where or how. <laughs> it's- it's the- it's the- it's the- the blue song, you know? Wait! Did it not happen? I'm Wait, did- Buddha. Bodida, 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 Body. Okay, I I think I actually muted when I said the things. <laughs> Uh, that's... Thank you for that, Palm. <laughs> well spoken, Badida. <laughs> Badida. Uh... You should probably go and look at your eyebrows for roughly four and a half hours. Wait, you have work tomorrow, Chris? No, you need you need sleep. Damn, you've been up for so long. Hope you enjoy the rest of your time in the stars, all the bloody, and not a single of the bloody. Thank you so much, Chris. I hope you have a wonderful four and a half hours of sleep. I hope you have, you should have had more though, but thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you hanging out for so long. I'm also not going to be streaming for much longer. Um, I just hope that I can find a save point. It's just last time we found a save point that was like three and a half hours into stream. And that felt like too short of a time, so I was like, you know, because it's it's a little bit long between the, the save points now. <laughs> but thank you so much for the lurk. Thank you so much for the lurk. You meant eyelids, not eyebrows. Sure, are you sure? I mean, I thought you said it on purpose. <laughs> uh, look out for wrinkles. Mm. <laughs> doesn't get any bluer don't need no man to help me mm. that quote happened again yeah <laughs> um a closet you open it you found the angry key you put the angry key in your pocket you now know where the angry key is located keychain daily yeah we have that's a different face than the key you've gotten before why are the faces different does it mean something? What is this about? Oh, every keychain will probably have a different mask. Huh. So every mask will have a different emotion? Is this what it's trying to represent? Oh, I know this one. That's the change god. No matter what emotion it has, if it has a mask, that's the change god. The change god always has a mask. It never has the same expression. Or art style. For that matter. It's to show the change god is ever-changing, but also to show us that emotions are fleeting. No matter how wonderful or awful you're feeling, this feeling will fade in time. Why do good emotions have to fade too? Why can't we keep being happy forever? That'll be boring. Can you imagine? It'll be like, hmm, like being forced to eat your favorite food forever. I'd like that though. 
Are you sure? Really imagine it. Eating only your favorite food all the time. Can I stop eating when I'm full? Nope. Can't do anything except eat. I can't go to the bathroom? Nope. That would suck. Indeed. Just like feeling terrible forever would suck too. And some of those feelings might stay for a while. Make their home there. Or m make their home here. But knowing they'll eventually go away. Isn't it a relief? We found the door where this key fits. Um... Uh, we have not been here before. No, we have. Never mind. I was lying. Did we go straight up? Yeah. Someone frozen in time. Her! Whoa! She's another housemaiden. I always wanted to talk to her. She's so cool. Crafted pieces are always so perfect. I want to be just like her when I grow up. Huh? But you're an adult, Belle. You're already grown. Hmm. I... Oh no, she's realizing she's a real actual grown adult. Don't go through this realization, Mira. It'll be okay. Oh! No, sorry. If It's not that. It's just... She looks so scared. I... Let's go, everyone. Please. Sure, Mira. Um, would you rather feel miserable all the time or happy all the time? Is that an actual question? I feel like that that has an obvious answer. <laughs> Who would want to be miserable all the time, though? A hole in the wall. A hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. This gate is locked. It's locked by one of those weird word locks. There's something written above the lock, too. Maybe you should take a co closer look. Try to read what is written. I cannot read what is written above the lock. Just trying to read this makes my head hurt. Mm, let's see. Look at it curiously. You look at it. Isabel sees you look. Have you never seen a lock like this before? Say if it's yeah, 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 we have heard that before. I just wanted to see if it had something else to say. Hmm. Such an imposing door, though. I don't remember ever seeing it before. Hmm. There's some text written above the door, though. Look, it says... Yowch. Yowch? No, no. It's just... My head hurts. <laughs> Um, and no way of feeling the other way. Mm. Yeah, I would obviously say happy. Um, did they say what they're crafting? Uh, I mean, crafting is just uh, special magic skills, I guess. I, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, but you didn't choose to do, to be Palm. No, fuck. That's not what I meant. I just wanted to skip through the, the thing. What I wanted to click was one of the other options. Um... Let's try the last one. I know it won't work though, because we already used it. Say it's the storage room. 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 Yeah. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. It's like if you weren't able to express all the negative or bad stuff and was like forced to be happy all the time, it wouldn't be the best of. No, but it would still be better than the opposite one. The point of an ultimatum is that it's 
it's not gonna be ideal either way. <laughs> They're both gonna suck if you have to choose one or the other. If you were happy, you would have no need to express unhappiness. True, true. Crafting is a bit lost how what that is in the game world. Yeah, it's kind of like spells. It's not really lost. Um, it's just... I feel like it's just a different word of for, for spells. Ah, fuck. I was hoping I could avoid that. Paper. We need a paper. That's what you kind of trying to scope. Like, would it actually be better? Because ultimate thing like that is not good either way. But is it really that obvious? Yeah, because none of them will be good if it's the only thing you would feel, but if you had to choose one or the other, I feel like having only positive things would be better than having only negative things, you know? To me, it would be very obvious. Go and you breathe in and out. Ugh, I just I just wanna be able to save. Key time, you insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. <gasps> Weird smelly one. What free crest sadness. Let's go. There's so many places to use the, the crest. Dude, that's rude. Okay, so not scissor attack. Super sparkle heal. Let's try smash. Okay. So let's try paper. Paper. No missing. Weird smell when you feel called out. Everybody farted. To <laughs> That's a weird thing to ask. May yeah, you see how her um, her image is different, probably because of how low her health is. God Star Crest. What wait what Boniface, what do you mean by weird spells? What 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 is Why do you skip through all the dialogue like that? I didn't choose that. Hmm. I mean could use that. It's it feels like a little bit of a waste. Ah, fine. A 
hole in the wall. The hole doesn't really bring you anywhere. Boniface, what about this wall? What does it smell like? Like a crabbing wall. Okay, good, good talk. Sirius so said so. Wait, what? Okay, where should we go, though? Because there's so many places with the... The tear floats silent, uh, silently, by, by the way. Gently. It was Starcrest, so... Use the Starcrest. Sure. I don't know if this was the best place to use it, but... Uh-oh. Wrong way, Stardust. Well, some papers. You pick one at random. It's a random... Uh, it's a poem about lovers on a bridge. There's a note with the word open phrase 123 written on it. You look at it a little closer. Is that... An open phrase for something? That sounds very safe and not at all stupid. Hmm. Okay, so we have one open phrase then. There's a bunch of unfinished poems on the desk. Isabel slaps his hand on one of them. Mira! Yes, yes, I'm reading. Oranges are nice. Oranges are soft. Oranges are frail. When you look at me, I feel like one. <laughs> Your fingernail digs into my cheek. Peel an orange open. The poem ends here. Is this a clue? No, it's just someone's unfinished poem. Let's finish it for them. Do we have time? Do we really have time to do this right now? Peel an orange open. Orange juice comes out. Oh, Shems. Um, um. Peel an orange open. The person who wrote this is the orange, right? That seems to be one interpretation, yes. Okay, so... I die. Hmm, mm, very literal, very nice. Blood oranges? Something with that? Something bloody but poetic? I haven't heard a single good idea yet. Madame, do you have something then? No. Yeah, yeah, leaving us young people to do the job, I get it. Sif, your turn. Peel an orange open. It's get it gets very appealing. <laughs> we we have to do the punny option. Ha! Huh. Sifrin. You take a bow. No one except Isabeau claps. Yeah, that seems to be the case every time. There's a note with the word open for it. Wait, but we have read that some papers. You pick one at random. It's a poem about someone going to a grave. Okay. Um, did you go talk? No, we died because of the, uh, the, the, the banana peel. <laughs> you find an anthology of horror stories. On the cover, a handsome young man looks into the night fearfully but longingly. Oh, Mira, looks like the kind of books you like, huh? Horror books. This one looks massive. What's this one called? That's the hand handsome young men falling into beautiful, heartbreaking madness horror anthology. Whoa. Mirabelle's yelling made you jump. Did did someone in the house have it all this time? Did someone keep it from you? What is it, anyway? It's a full anthology of, uh, all about pure-hearted boys being subjected to awful monsters and horror situations. Seeing them screaming in fright cannot help but root for them and at the same time be happy I'm not in their situation <laughs> there's something lovingly touching about those tales something wonderfully hopeful I cannot help but read them and pray for their um, survival so so they do they usually survive or do the monsters catch them well 50 50 what but also Catharsis that fills my whole being when they get caught. There's something very wonderful about that, too. The Schadenfreude? The Schadenfreude. 
cat forces. <laughs> Scott and Frober. Don't worry about it, Bonbon. Bon. I too am also lost. It's just, it's very good. Very moving. Makes me feel like I went on a run. And also, sometimes the heroes end up bonding with the monsters too. What? Oh, romance. I understand the romance part. Looks about terrible things happening to good people, huh? When we finally get our book club going, I would love to know if you have more books like this one. Boy, do I. You laugh quietly. You hope they get to have their book club soon. And then I loop back into the place. Yeah, I did. Annoying orange. Oh, damn. I remember that. <laughs> Some books all lined up. There's a space in between two books. Like someone removed it. Ah, Bonnie seems to be reading it intently. It has a very striking cover and a of a Muudu clan figurine with large sunken eyes and a scream, screaming mouth. You can't read the title. You're curious. What do you have here? Bonnie hides the book in their pocket. N nothing. It's nothing. Nothing at all. Sure. Okay. Shut up. It's fine. I'm fine. S stop looking at it. Stop looking at me. Shut up. You take the book instead. Bonnie shoves a book at you. Sneezing. How to expose bad thoughts. Wow. Some vials. Let's see. You got two salty broths. A note for a festival that was supposed to take place today. Okay. Um, so it says that we can't progress now because the X is like, that means that we have to die to get back. Um, ah, fuck. I was hoping that I could escape that. Okay, that was fast. <laughs> that was fast. Yeah, so that was not the place to use the... Um... The thing. But we do have an extra open phrase, though. I want to see if we can still use that. On one of the doors. Because there was supposed to be one... It was this way. Here. Can we use it here? Open phrase one, two, three. You say the sentence, open phrase one, two, three, aloud. Nothing happens. Worth a try. Okay. Well, yeah. That means that we have to die. So let's just... The tear uh, floats gently. Touch it. Yes. Looping time. Reach out to the tear. You had a good sleep. So we're gonna go back up here. Loop back to floor three. You wake up. You don't actually exactly dream when you're frozen in time, but it's similar. Or more like it's a slice of a dream stretched into minutes, hours, days. A single thought, concept forever rolling out like taffy. You dreamt about bananas. Reach towards the light. Everyone was healed. 
Your allies' craft skills and experience has been recorded for this location. Say progress, yes. Because this is where we're gonna end today. We're gonna end here. Hold on. A very good place to stop. The teeth made you feel uncomfortable. <laughs> Can't believe sometimes that you're older than YouTube. I mean... Is it that weird, though? Everyone is full of shit here. <laughs> uh, hold on. Let me, let me put on some music. But it's been... It's been good, though getting back to this game because I missed it. I just have not been able to stream on Tuesdays for a while. So it was it was nice to be able to do that again. Because this is the Tuesday game. It is our Tuesday game after all. Um but I also feel like we made a lot of progress today. Probably the most progress uh, in one stream playing this game so far. Maybe. I'm not entirely sure. Um, hey, Craig! Thank you for, for the lurk. I'm I'm just about to end, though. Um. But yeah, it's been good. It's been good. Oh, you have been lurking. I see, I see. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you. I hope, I hope you've been well, though, Craig. <laughs> I love the the courage uh, emotes <laughs> emotes. Uh, but yeah, it's been fun. It's been fun. I really do enjoy this game. It is a good game. I can't believe what I have gotten four achievements and there are forty three in total. That is insane. I've gotten so few. I have nine percent of all the achievements. It's wild. Uh, just wanted to pop in and say hi before you ended. Hope you all are well. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Hope you've been well as well. I'm doing good. I'm so tired today. Okay. Uh, <laughs> only once. Uh... I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, I don't understand what you guys are talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. You just hear casually ruining Orion's life. No, don't ruin Orion's life. ignore it because I don't know the rules so you know I I'm gonna I'm gonna ignore it because that's just how it is that's just how it is um but yeah so tomorrow I think we're gonna go back to um Weko the mask gatherer because it's it's a short game it's a fairly short game so I, f I think we're gonna be able to either finish it tomorrow or I think it's gonna be like a two or three stream long game and we have streamed it once and that was on Saturday so we'll see if we can finish it tomorrow we can see if we can finish it tomorrow and then um, we're probably gonna go back to Elden Ring on well, during the weekend streams, so on on Friday and Saturday, I think. But yeah, tomorrow will be the last stream of the month. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Also, I really like this Weko game. Like in in the sense that it's it's very chill. It has really nice and chill music. So it's it's a cozy game. I'm not reading that. <laughs> I'm not reading that, Pom. 
Uh, it looks comfy. Mm. Hey, as long as I don't know the rules and I'm never gonna know the rules, I am never gonna be able to participate. So, you know, that's how I avoid the thing. It's, it doesn't matter because I can't hear it unless I remove my, my headphones. One, you're so always I playing can't game. hear what you Two, say. You lose when you think of it. I can I can talk over it as well. Three. So it, it doesn't matter. You lose. I can't hear you tell the ones it. I to can't you. hear anything. Uh, or do you know about it? No, I don't. I actually don't. I don't know anything. After that. I don't know anything. Five. I I don't know you can never win. what you assume that I'm I'm gonna know. I don't know I don't know shit. You don't know anything. Don't. I don't know. I didn't hear him. I, I didn't hear him. <laughs> I can't tell you. Uh, hold on. Let me see. Let me check. Let me see if there's anyone on that is... Um... Let's see if anyone is playing this game. It's literally only two people. It's literally only two people. But I... Hold on. I feel like they're both ahead of me. Only it's only game. Why you have to be mad? That scared me. <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> now we'll we'll just raid someone we know. We'll raid someone we know. Um... Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> but thank you for the 100 bits, Palm. And for the 5 bits, Orion. Um, let us raid... Sh we can raid Chica. Yeah, we can raid Chica today. Um, I think that's a good, good idea. Um, yeah, let's do that. I'll do that. She's also part of CKT, so let us gi go give her a follow. And well, uh, well, that too. If you're not following, but I'm, um, I mean a raid. But you can also follow. You should. Um, she is playing Inscription, by the way. In case anyone is curious about what she's gonna be playing. But yeah, thank you so much for being here, guys. I'm gonna copy the raid message. Um. But yeah, thank you so much for for hanging out and and and. It's been it's been fun. I, I feel like I've talked so much today though. Well, I mean it it kind of is how it is with these games. You have to read everything. So I feel like my voice is getting really tired. <laughs> my voice is getting really tired. So tomorrow it's gonna be a little bit more chill. I mean there's a little bit of reading there too, but it's not a not as much at all. Not as much. But yeah, thank you so much, everyone, for everything you've done, for following, for, for lurking, for, for giving bits or subbing, gifting subs, anything. I appreciate you all. And I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good one, everyone. And uh, yeah.